G'day everybody and welcome to Splitsy Super Saturday Survival Stream. Yeah. Capac. <laughs> How you going, Capac? Oh uh, yeah. Going all Today, right. Capac and I are celebrating the fact that just a bit over five years ago, we released our first video on YouTube. It was the first episode of Light Echoes, which was a cinema series, and this is probably going to be the last time that Capac and I are going to be able to do a super long stream like this as housemates. So we wanted to do something big. And we're going to start out by playing Never Surrender as soon as I die and get to the respawn menu. Wait, we can't start yet. Why not? Because I've got another announcement. Oh? Uh, so I got a special birthday present this year. Yeah? From Twitch. Oh, your partner! So I made Twitch partner this week. Congratulations, Capac. So Stop. I thought I'd save that up for the, <laughs> the big Saturday stream. Congratulations, mate. Well earned. So I thought one of us should start in the space pod and one of us should start on the Earth-like drop pod. I was going to vote you start on the Earth-like drop pod. Uh, okay. And I'll start in the space pod. Uh, I will find an ice lake near you and you should head to your nearest ice lake and we should meet up there so we can build up stuff as quickly as possible. Because okay. we've got about three hours until we need to get up to space and fight the enemies. But if we go to an ice lake, we can easily get fuel and energy and all that sort of stuff. Okay. All right. So respawning in five, four, three, two, one, respawn. All right. I need to get myself some parachutes to begin with. Oh dear. What? I ooh. I don't see started. any ice at all. Oh no. All right. Um <laughs> well this could get interesting. Um I mean How there's far are you from the space base. You have a space base GPS? I don't see anything. There you go. Uh, the space pod should be able to land on Earth without without exploding if if I put some parachutes on it before I go down there. What I'm going to do is uh, head over to this asteroid here, Ooh. grab some stuff. Um, what? how big do you think this planet is? 120 kilometers. Yep, I think the space base is on the other side of the planet. Okay, what I want you to do. <laughs> is turn off your survival kit. Okay. You done that? Yep. Now press backspace. Uh, what? And respawn. What? Uh. You should be able to drop in another drop in with another pod. How rude! I mean, <laughs> you've you've certainly reduced the time to death counter down to almost nothing. Well, I mean, I started my stream with me dying. While you were saying you got partner, I died. Uh, right. <laughs> Thanks, Blakey. Thanks so much, man. Uh, hopefully, uh, you'll be able to join us later when we go over to Twitch and do some other games like Jackbox. Uh, yeah. What? Uh, I mean, this five-minute respawn time seems kind of punishing. Oh, do you have to hold, wait the full five minutes? Oh, well, that's that's what it says. All right, scrap this planet. You're joining my faction, and you're going to come spawn with me. Okay. All right. Uh, join the zebra monkeys faction. We'll both parachute down to an ice lake. Uh. Uh. Do you have to like share it with faction or something? Oh, yeah, probably. That's right. My silly survival kits always start unshared. I'm just going to vent this place. Capac's going to do it anyway. So, as you guys might notice, I have added a few mods to this scenario, uh, which requires you modifying the save files sandbox.sbc. There's a line in it that says vanilla. And you can change that from true to false, and then you're able to add mods to the save, uh, which I have done to allow us to have things like build vision. 
Scooping up all the space rocks. The ship said it had 500% hydrogen? What? Ooh. That'll be helpful. It does. Maybe the HUD's broken. Uh, I can't access the cargo container. Arrgh. There you go. Now you can. Uh, yes, as it turns out, Takamiki, I should have set the whole ship to share with faction, <laughs> not just the survival kit. Uh, right. He just this... doesn't like sharing. Hey! Brought you along. <laughs> Apparently the devs don't think I like sharing. The uh, handy thing about starting out with this one is we'll get some nice resources to start with and we get the ion thrusters so we can fit these onto our future space going ship so we don't have to use hydrogen the whole time plus we start with a big battery there's always a big bonus oh hang on haha <laughs> Oh no, wait, I have to do it this way. Dang it! I about to say, haha, I turned off progression. But as it turns out, that doesn't help me right now. Thanks so much, Mackle. <laughs> Been a while since I've done this, but I'll get an early start. Oof. Also, the time is ticking. The drones are coming around on that clock. Yes. Capac, no. I have three hours. Three hours of prep, Capac. I hate ticking clocks. Now, the confusing thing for me is I started streaming to YouTube to get everything set up ages ago, so we're going to have to rely on chat to tell us when three hours is. Oh, boy. Because my current live time says an hour and 38. There isn't, like, an in-game thing we can see? Nope. Not that I'm aware of. Hmm. I mean, I think with build info, you can put a clock up or something, or with the compass mod, maybe that was. I don't know. Oh, man. Uh, thanks for the subs, Tesla and Firefly, and thanks for the cheers to Burra and Lucky Seven Gaming. Inventory full. All right, cool. I will subtract an hour thirty. So when my timer hits four hours and thirty, Capac and I will need to launch to space and try and save the station. Oh dear. What? Usually it doesn't go well when I have to save things. Confused, why is it not giving me access to the survival kit stuff? This doesn't make sense! Uh oh, we've broken it already. Oh no, uh. Dragnon's carpet bombed the chat! Oh, it's probably because it hasn't actually done any of it yet. And Sassink, the cheers, thank you. Thank you, Dragnon, thank you, Mackle. Uh, this is on a... Philip, this is not on a public server. This is just me hosting the game for Capac and I. This is a cooperative scenario of sorts. Slightly less laggy that way. Well, a lot less laggy, <laughs> I imagine, Capac. Your ping to me is 27. This is an okay ping. <laughs> I think that's as good as Space Engineers gets. Yeah. And of course, for me, it's zero lag, because I'm host. Sounds Yay. like cheating. Well, I mean, the, the host advantage will probably come in to be a bigger factor when we joust after this. When you betray me. Well, I've set up a whole jousting arena for it. Turns out Splitsy's been on the side of the drones the whole time. He's not listening to me. I 
I should not be surprised. Look, that's a different time and space. That doesn't apply to this situation. Uh, yes, Dragodar, you can use the eye key on the front of this, but you can't use build vision, uh, sorry, build planner through the front of it. And that's what I was trying to use. That's why I had to get around to the survival port, the cargo port. Uh-oh. Uh, I think the storage on the ship is full. Is it? Have you mined that much already? I can't put any rocks in. Uh, yes, we have mined that much already. We just gotta wait then. Uh, can we build another storage somewhere? No. Oh, because we need cobalt. Yep. Uh, have you scouted about to see if there's any ores on this rock? Uh, I haven't. Do you want to do that? Maybe GPS where I am, where the ship is for the moment? Yeah, I'll be able to find it. Jeez, it's dark in here. Oh, dang it. Thank you, Sergeant Bacon. I'm a dope. Such a dope. I placed the refinery wrong. Well, I mean, I guess you got what you wanted. What? There's a whole lot of ice here. Uh, okay. Like a lot of ice. Still, I'm still tossing up whether it's better to go down to the planet where it'll be easier to find the ores. Or whether it's better to stay up here, like... Uh, yeah. Think... Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure which will be faster. The trouble with going, the trouble with staying up here is it's quite hard to find all the stuff we need. The trouble with going down to the planet is then we have to deal with gravity and making sure we can get back off the planet. Uh, so I think both have their advantages and disadvantages. Because we got to try and do this as quickly as possible which means finding the res the resource finding time is important <laughs> thanks so much dragnon well and yes i will not forget five canvas per shoot uh, yep. never ever forget that that's a good tip um okay well i can't do much while i can't fill up with rocks so what i might do is I might head over to some of these nearby asteroids. Okay. Good see call. if I can find anything useful. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Oh, the other thing that's an advantage of being up in space is that we could pirate a cargo ship. Uh, Maybe we should just start up here then. Oh, thanks for all the subs, Sassink, Executive Storm. Oh, that's a good thought, Talos. The moon. Then we can be, we can kind of vaguely head toward the moon. Oh, yeah, my power is a little low. Should be alright though. Hmm. Uh, how far are we from the moon? Uh, Not ooh, sure. Pretty far. We're pretty far. Will yeah. it take us a solid hour to get there anyway? Uh, I think so. Okay. Never mind that then. Thanks, Brian. I just need those motors. Cancel those. Let's just get these motors done. Uh, is there anything I could steal motors from? I don't think there is. Oh yeah, I know. I know that the catwalk I ground off here was making this airtight, but I don't really need that to be airtight. 
for our purposes. Alright, do a quick flyby. See if I can... Oops. <laughs> Did you just splat? <laughs> I mean, I guess that's a quick way back. <laughs> uh, I mean, I lost a couple of job. rocks, but... Well done, Kavak. I didn't see anything, so I assume that asteroid is useless. <laughs> Thanks, Black Phoenix. Oh, wow. Now Max off to, a, off to a strong start. He's now in the lead with two deaths. Uh, I don't think the first one counts. Well, if my first one counts, your first one counts. I don't think either of those ones count. Okay, you're in the lead. With one to zero. Well, I was still in the lead regardless. <laughs> <laughs> this is an unusual way to fight about who's in the lead. Come on, just three more motors and then we'll have the assembler. So I think our best plan here is let's go hunt for some cobalt. If we don't find cobalt quickly, we will go down to the planet. Uh, right. Right. Because uh, we do need to get cobalt quickly. That's going to be a big hold up if we don't get it in time. Yeah. I guess I'll go on another expedition. Uh, I was going to fly the ship, if you want to well, come on board. Well, you can come meet me. I got I full know. energy this time. I don't know which, <laughs> did you die of energy-related stuff? Or did you no, just, no. I, you splattered. I didn't lean into the turn. Oh, yeah, did, does this have an ore detector on it? It doesn't. I does thought it? it did. Does it? I don't know. I'm too far away to see now. Uh, no, it does not. But if I make one, then I've got a 150 meter range ore detector. <laughs> well, if we had this world set on permanent death, the stream would be over already. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I mean, just because it doesn't count for us doesn't mean it doesn't count for the game. Indeed. Okay. Let's cancel the survival kit doing stuff. They're fine, I can just work on things. Actually, let's put that there. <laughs> Kapak with one body in the lead. Will Splitzy continue to expand, expand that lead by any means necessary? Hey! <laughs> uh, oh. Hmm. Ah, uh, ooh, what? And that space base is a lot closer this time. A lot closer than what time? Well, it was like 130 kilometers away when I was down on the planet. Yes. Hey, Beth. No, I won't. I won't deliberately murder Capac. Accidental murder, fine. Deliberate murder, no. I guess oh. Manslaughter's okay. Oh, I hate having to do an orbital rendezvous with my backpack. Are you actually going to get your stuff? Yeah, might as well. I thought you would have just left it. Also, now that we've got a refinery, you could actually be useful just coming back and mining. Oh. <laughs> Left a bunch of tools in space. That's right. I'll scout out this asteroid and then I'll come back. And I'll try not to smash into it this time. Okay... The next thing I think that would be most useful would be to stick a drill on the front of this thing. Um, are unknown signals worth collecting? Um, yeah, go for it if you want.
you've recently mucked around a bit with the uh, economy stuff, haven't you? A little bit. Well, I have left it on. Okay. Hmm. Uh, how far away is that station that I just got? 56 k's. It's not too bad. All right, let's fix up my hotbar here. That, that, that. That, and that. Hmm. Not picking up any minerals. No. I really hope they give the ships some other way of generating power for the battery than just hydrogen if they're going to have an oil detector and oh, fill on it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I, I can just put some O2H2 gens on here since I've got the hydrogen engine. Oh, I guess I should mark it. Um, What'd you find? Just ice. Ah. Which we already have. But yeah, mark it anyway because we need to know where stuff is. There could be other stuff there. I only found ice. Okay, ore detector. Max range. What are we detecting? Ice, ice, and ice. Uh, actually, I might just hang here and drill while Kavak searches. Try and get this big drill working so that I can mine the asteroid properly. Right, tennis ball, what have you got for me? Rainbow drill. And Rainbow some space drill. bucks. Hooray! Oh, I could send you the GPS for that station if you want. There you go. Uh, how far is it? Uh, 56 k's. Ugh. Yeah, I don't know if yeah. I want a jetpack there. No, you probably don't want a jetpack there. But once we get a bit of a survival base set up once with a, all the necessary bits, then you can start building a separate ship, because I think having two ships will be more useful. Uh, probably both large grid, if we can afford it. Uh, acceptable, that's unlikely. Except for, you know, Escape from Purgatory, which is on a public server. Otherwise, uh, hosting something for lots of people to join is more work than more work of managing a server than I wa ever want to be a part of. I'd much rather make videos than uh, be a server admin, because server admining is hard. Yeah, we really just need. Cobalt first. Until we find Cobalt, we are stuck. Uh, what do we need to make an ore detector? The ore detector's made. Oh, cool. Um, the ore detector's made. I'm making a drill on the front so that I can collect stone without us having to mine by hand. Oh, yep. So I've kind of made a narwhal. Except with a drill. Okay. Uh, alt middle mouse, Michelle. Uh, I've got a full build planner tutorial if you are uh, unsure on the shortcuts. You just look for build planner tutorial. It'll give you all of the necessary bits on those very handy shortcuts. Narwhal, narwhal swimming in space. What? Yeah, there's a narwhal song. There is? Yeah. No. Oh. What's that from? Uh, it's from like a YouTube video. Uh, actually, it may have been from 
That might even have been a flash animation. Oh, like pre-YouTube. Hmm. Wow. Back in the dark times. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm aware of the auto or pickup mod, but it's... I tend to make sure I'm drilling by hand as little as possible, so it seems like an extra mod for a very short period of my gameplay. So I don't tend to worry about it. Uh, instead, the mods that I've gotten for this are the HUD mod, Energy low. Um, the uh, build info, build vision, and... What else do I put on this? Oh, sneaky sounds, so that the drill and welder and everything don't deafen us all. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I didn't want to put too many... I didn't want to put any mods that would give us an advantage. Whoa! What? Weren't you sitting in a seat? No, I just got out of the seat. Why'd you get out of the seat? Just so I could put stuff in the container. Yeah, but I'm using the drill now. The container's almost full. Yeah. Um, where was that station? You are you thinking we should head toward it? Oh, uh, but was this going to add the GPS? How do... Go into your GPS menu. It's not showing up. Is there well, a way to copy it out of the chat? Hang on. There you go. Now it'll show up. Hop back in the seat so I can fly to the next asteroid, would you? Oh, unless I drive. Just fly, quickly fly around to the ice. And we build a couple of O2H2 gens. So that we can turn on the hydrogen engine. Okay. Just to ensure we don't run out of power. Oh, that station Thanks, looks David. like it's down on the surface. Oh, is it a... Oh, it is too. Ooh. That's not a bad thing. Yeah, I could leave him... Um... I'm guessing that's <laughs> DE if you're saying Capac normally leaves me. Um, what? How rude. But then he'd blame me for having yet another death more than me. I certainly would. Don't abandon your friends in a survival situation. You mean like you kept trying to when we were playing Raft the other day? Yeah, like that. Wait, me? Yeah, you he, were abandoning me. You're the one who kept swimming off. You're the one who kept trying to sail off. Look, if a ship oh, is underway <laughs> and somebody jumps off it to fight a shark, that is not the ship sailing away from them. That is them swimming away from the ship. Oh, I wasn't talking about that time. I was talking about every time we were at an island and I was mining. Well, you shouldn't take so long. Also, Chibi the One, Gamers Refuge, and Mysterionic, thanks for all the subs. Uh, Kapak, could you pop out and... Oh, actually, never mind. I've gotten to the ice. Oh, you know the ice that I marked on the other side of the asteroid was um, on the on the surface. Thanks for telling me now that I already <laughs> did the mining. <laughs> Real useful, Capac. Real useful. Well, I do what I can. All right, help me build a couple of O2H2 gens. Uh, there we go. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Uh, I reckon if we go like this. There we go. Pop them on there. Okay. And then I'll connect them up. Yep. This one's hooked up, but the rear one isn't. Uh, this is not going to be a new series. This is going to be wrapped up today on stream. Um... We can build a lot faster than this thing can make parts. Yes, that is true. 
Uh, should I scout out another something. asteroid? Uh, no, I'll just drill out a little bit of this ice, because I think the drill still has some cargo space. Yep, it has plenty. And then we can just move move on. No, no, I'll drill it. Watch out. It's not drill coming through. Well, I need something to do. You will have something to do soon. Alright, you go scout some random asteroids and I will as well. Okay, that'll do. Uh, did you want to hop in seat or are you good for oxygen? Why don't you fill up your uh, O2? I'm good. You can you can take off if you wish. Okay. You heard him, everyone. I can take off if I wish. Uh, let's go toward the station. I'm scouting these out. Uh, there's an asteroid in that direction. Oh, fine, that one will do. Uh, I mean, or you could try and get to that um, SOS signal. Uh, I have no idea why my hydrogen meter says 500. Uh, does anyone know why the a fresh new view HUD might show that? Maybe the spawn ship is overloaded on purpose so that you don't run out. Oh, could be. Oh, I wonder. I wonder if the I I wonder if the engine has more. No, it says one hundred percent. Huh. It still says one hundred percent. How's it coming along? Oh, you got the first one built. Nice. Yep. See, you can be useful. Hey. You were the one saying you didn't know what you could do. Yeah, I thought it might be something to do with the hydrogen rebalance. The spawn ship apparently has more hydrogen than the new one does the new engine probably because it's set specifically for it the keen haven't adjusted that oh jeez nyan cat pack see what this ride has for us. Yep, both the O2s are done. Wait, good job. Uh, nickel and magnesium. Oh, okay, that's that's good. We need magnesium. Can you spot anything else, or it's probably just going to be those two? Yeah, probably. Alright, uh, let's head on. There's another asteroid basically dead ahead of me. Did you do a, do a GPS? I did. Did you? Uh, nope. Oh uh, yeah, Kabak, you might want... Uh, once you get back on board... We can probably build a hydrogen, a small hydrogen tank. Okay. Are you coming around? And then once we find cobalt, we've got magnesium location, and that's kind of it. Be handy if we find silver and stuff. Yeah, the ore detector range is set to 150. Which is 
the maximum vanilla. Uh, I guess I'll just stick it off the top here. Uh, that's probably not the most practical way to do it, Kavak. Maybe Makes you it look like it down a steamship. Put a conveyor junction. No, that's no fun. All right. Thanks, talking beans. In my schedule, I finally get to see a live stream. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, the uh, ultra-long nature of this stream will mean more people who haven't caught us in the past will be able to catch us. And happy birthday, Capac, from Talking Beans. Uh, Congratulations, thank you. Congratulations, Capac, on reaching partner and your 40th birthday. Hey! <laughs> Rude. Uh... Oh, survival kit. I wonder That's how many I'm people on. are going to believe that. Well, everybody now. <laughs> uh, thanks for sub blue seven and the cheers granite row. Have you? Have you? Um. Did you mention where all all today's funding is going? Uh yeah, it's all going towards our office, and that is something that we've started because Capac and I. This is kind of the last chance we have to do a big long stream like this, which I did mention earlier, but a big long stream like this where we are in the same place, or well, living together as housemates. Um, we will no longer be living together as of the end of April, but we do have... Cobalt! Uh, we do have an office that we've signed a lease for, which we're going to be using so that we can still record in the same space. I can't believe we got lucky enough to find Cobalt straight away, basically. That is crazy. We can find Iron, we will definitely expedite what we're up to here. That blob, need to get rid of it. So what Capac and I are hoping to do with having an office space is maybe even do some like tabletop gaming and things like that. It's something we really want to be able to do. Uh, that's more than enough cobalt. Probably forever. Can you find anything else on this asteroid? I'm having a look. I haven't seen anything. Right. Thanks again, Talking Beans. I think Capac and I should build a large cargo. Uh, also, I reckon looting and or piracy is going to be our fastest way to get stuff, Capac. Alrighty. Can we... You can't see anything other than Cobalt, can you? No. I've done a couple of laps. And no. I haven't seen anything. Cool. That's fine. We can now do some decent expansions on this. And because progression's off, we can move the thrusters as well if we need to. <laughs> no, the office space is not just something I made with Lego. But it is somewhere where we might play with Lego. And um, thanks, Jason. Uh... Yeah, Cap. The, the office space we found, there's some shared space which we should have access to, especially out of hours, which might allow us to do things like D&D &D and other things like that. Which is something that I'm really excited to try because I've never really done it. But also, Tiny Teddies go to war. <laughs> That's something I'm excited to play <laughs> as well. Because, man, that was fun at PAX. Uh, Tiny Teddies go to war is a tabletop game where you fight with uh, those little biscuits that are called Tiny Teddies. 
Um, and you eat your dead as you go along. Oh, isn't that what you usually do? Is that why there are so many dead Kamaks? Because you get hungry. No, it's less wasteful. Hey, can I judge you? That is true. We could crash land onto the station on the planet without parachutes and we wouldn't take damage unless we bounced out. Then we'd take a lot of damage. That mm, would be bad. Sounds like a reckless plan. Yeah, I, I don't think that's the plan we should go with. We'll need that and we'll need that. Uh, so I think the f as soon as you've done that, the next thing we should be building is an assembler, a yeah. proper assembler. Yep, yep. Uh, yeah. Actually, I might just make the parts for it. Uh, the office is kind of off to the side. It's about twenty-minute drives away from both of us, where we'll be living. Once we move out of here. Oh, thanks for the gift subs, Queen's Wolf, and the sub, Crazy Irish. There's the drill. There. Yeah, we really, it'd be really, really, really handy for us to find some uh, iron. Thanks, Kenneth. Irons. I might turn my lights on. That'd help. I mean, they don't help much. Uh, Kapak, if you wanted to, you could go scout from here. Although, maybe we should just scout from here. We don't need the Cobalt Asteroid anymore. Let's fly to a different one. Right. Like, I've mined enough Cobalt that we shouldn't need any again. I'll meet you there. Uh, where? Oh, wait. I don't know. Um, share me a cobalt GPS. <laughs> I've gone to the next asteroid. I think it was the next closest one. There you go. Kabak, did you do something to the gyroscope? I no. <laughs> like what? Like, I can't move my ship at all? No, didn't, didn't. I haven't even sat in the command seat of the ship. There's no gyro. Where'd the... Oh, no. Oh, no. What? I think the gyro might have been attached to the thruster. It was. It's floating in underneath. What? Yeah. The Wait. thruster I moved upward. Oh, dear. Whoops. Lucky that didn't explode. What the? Beep. What is that thing? Doesn't look like an asteroid. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You can tell how many times I've actually built stuff with this pod that I didn't realize where the gyroscope was. Um. Yeah. Do you, do you want a large grid mining ship? You found a large grid mining ship? Yep. Uh, is it passive? Uh, it's dead in the water, but it's mostly intact. Give me your GPS. I'll head to you. Because yes, I do. Thanks, Michael. Yes, 43 minutes has passed. We need to go faster. <laughs> and thanks, random stuff by Chris. Uh, give me your GPS. I'll head to you. I'm trying. Try faster. Frank, oh, that's good. Uh... 
Did it just kill you? Yes. Is it actually a pirate ship? No, it's a wreck, but the gun turret is apparently still active. Okay. Uh, do we want to go back and get some magnesium from that magnesium asteroid? Yeah, we could probably take it out if we're careful. Alright. Uh, let me get to head towards it a bit then. Thanks, Garrus. <laughs> yeah, I I imagine being in a sort of a tabletop environment would give Capac and I even more capacity to be idiots to each other. Capac now leads with two deaths to zero. Sorry, Capac stretches his lead with two deaths to zero. Jeez, not that we're counting or anything. Once I'm counting, it's fun. Blech. <laughs> well, as per uh, usual. you remember your approach so you know how to get there safely. Uh, yes, it is a complex with other workplaces, the new office, so uh, we're, we'll be interested to see if any of the other people have issue with our... Um... No! 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 And... Ow! Oh. Admittedly. I thought you were actually having problems just now. <laughs> That's why I didn't give you much warning. Whoa! Yeah, if, you, if we can take that shipwreck, that will save us a lot of time. Hopefully we'll see a cargo ship or something go past that we can pirate. All means necessary. Um. Oh yeah, I must have burnt through enough of the hydrogen that the meat is now working properly. Oh. I think there's ice on that asteroid. Wonder what else is there. All right, that's one gun disabled. Good job. Oh, there might be silver on that. more silvery well it could still be ice okay two guns disabled good job it is ice oh that's not too bad ice and magnesium oh sweet yeah, but we've got magnesium right here as well. That could be handy. Yep, because we need oh, them guns. There's another gun. Alright, guess it's time to go join Capac. Uh, after I get some more oxygen. the shipwreck this way. Just another gun. Is this kind of wedged in the asteroid? No. Is this the one with the chess playing dudes? What? Chess dudes? Yeah, I think there's two dudes at the back playing chest. Chest, not chest. Chess! Chess! Oh, I found a door. Uh, which way is it safe to approach? Not sure. Okay, I'm right behind you. Hello. I think I might have gotten all the guns. 
Thanks, yeah. Michael Kelly. Yep, uh, I think it's clear. Thanks, man. Glad you could make it. Nothing inside? I haven't been inside. Uh, this hydrogen tank is almost full, though. Cool. Something on LCD in here. Can't see any guns. Let's get her patched up and underway. Okay, what does the LCD say? Automated log recording enabled. Both engines broke down, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Uh, go back, just make completely sure there isn't any gun here because we really don't want to destroy our own ship when we bring it over. Um, it's going to take a bit of work to repair this thing. Uh, there are... No guns. Oh, yeah. We gotta take over everything as well. Rats. That could take some time. We might just want to steal the bits and just rebuild a ship from scratch. Because there are lots uh... of, um, owned by the space pirates pieces on this thing. I'll go grab the pod, though, and bring yeah, it over. Most of them stuff we can get rid of. Well, that can be your ship. Um, you start working on it, and I'll keep expanding on the base pod to make it capable of building up all of our resources. Okay. Okay? Yeah. We'll each have a ship, and I think that'll be better for defending when we go to defend the base. Energy low. Oh, uh, where are you? I'm over at the pod. Where's the pod? It's over at the asteroid with the magnesium. Where, where is that? I'm about Wait, to send the you one we just or? left? Or a new yep. one? New one. Is it one of these ones? It's really nearby. Whoopsie. You about to run out of... Yeah, I'm getting Power pretty low. Or... No two. I'm gonna fly over to you, but that's right. I'm here. You're where? I am on board. Ah, uh, yeah, Mackle. I'm tempted to merge. But I'm also tempted to keep them as separate ships so Kapak and I can attack the drones from two different directions rather than being kind of surrounded. I feel like two separate ships might be beneficial, at least until we accidentally run into each other. Especially when one of them's expendable. Yeah, that's actually a good point. Having an expendable ship and then one that's got all of the refining capacity and everything on it. I take it your ship's the expendable one. Oh yeah, I found it on a rock. <laughs> I'm not, not overly concerned with what happens to it. Oh, hold on, there's a bunch of other stuff here I didn't even see. Anything in these cargo containers? Oh, what'd you find? Uh, an elite grinder and welder. Nice. Okay, time to set this thing up. Make it like the Enterprise. Capax the battle bridge and you're the disc. Um, I suppose we could, Dragnon. Alright, you start working on the emergency turbo lift that leads to the battle bridge. 
Mm -hmm. and, uh, how do I want to remodel this thing? Start by getting rid of this. This one out. Uh, yeah. I need to get cargo on this, but I need to get that big assembler up first. I think that's more important. Get the assembling happening faster. And then I'll start looking at things like gravel ejectors and stuff like that. Inventory full. Oh no! No! Why are you floating away? No, what did you do? Oh, just some of the salvage here just decided to take off into space. Well, quick, help me grind it down and get the bits. I can't, I'm full. I dropped them off at... here. Oh no, it's full! Uh, can we drop them off in yours? Maybe. Full. I feel like I should steal some of the cargo from yours oh, and put it on the main one. It's taking off because we're in gravity. We are? Uh, at least it is. Oh, we are partially in gravity. Yeah, it's 0.05. Inventory full. I don't really want to chase it then. Oh well, uh, that's not the best place for us to hang out then. Is there still gravity on the other side of this thing? How far do we have to go before it runs out? Far. Hmm. Alright, we definitely need to get your thrusters repaired before we convert that thing to a ship. Yeah. Uh, is there a cargo container I can steal from your ship? Steal? Yeah. Permanently take. Uh, this one will do. Well, as long as it doesn't break all the connections. No, nah, just it was directly behind a drill, so it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah, definitely would not play Never Surrender with our scrap. That would be a bad idea. That would make your life very, very, very difficult. And would make the prep time ex Oh no! Oh no! I did a bad thing. Huh? Those are the thrusters that were holding me up. Okay. Ooh, gravity components and thruster components. <sighs> that was close. That was very close. Habak, I don't like that you've dragged me into a gravity well. You gotta do what you gotta do. Inventory full. Uh oh, yeah, this thing has a hundred and two percent hydrogen too. Hmm. I think it might be a more common problem than I'd realized. Uh forward, up, down, left. Uh. Gannett, you might be right. One of these might crash into Earth before it's over. Uh, I don't have any right hydrogen thrusters. Wait, yes I do. Why don't you exist? Uh, 
<laughs> Just think of it as a trash can for components you don't want to deal with. Yes, the earth is my trash can. That seems like a good message. I mean, it is effective. Uh, yeah, I might upgrade my tools in a sec. Oh, okay. Um, hmm. Let's get some more iron. Inventory full. How are you going with prepping the ship? Uh, slowly. But I should have it underway in a sec. Stone to be processed, not magnesium and cobalt. Uh, the ship cargo bar is part of the build info mod. Thrusters. Quite handy. And really well integrated as well. Like cleanly integrated, which I like. Fiery. All right, you got stone. Getting iron. Oh, hold on. Ah, okay. I don't have a reverse thruster that's working. Why not? Is it not connected? What not connected? My reverse thrusters. I don't know. Oh, I think you might have disconnected it. This is exactly what, what I was afraid of. I did not. There was only a drill on what I ground off. There we go, I found one that works. So the mods that I have active in this are build info, build vision, sneaky sounds, um, a fresh new view colored which is the HUD mod uh, what else have we got we've got um, the Milky Way skybox and screen gunk be gone that's pretty much it oh and the um, UFOLS mod that makes the tra every bullet have a tracer so that when we start fighting, it'll be more spectacular. What the? Why won't this okay. trust to turn off now? I don't know. I don't know what you're doing. There is a time block here. I'm going to get rid of it. I wonder if it's doing something to you. Uh, no, not space just got real. I've got uh, screen gunk be gone. It's by Whiplash, I think. From vague memory. Why isn't this thruster showing up in the... Is it a separate panel? ship? 
Like it's a separate piece of something. It shouldn't be. It's all very much attached to everything else. Uh, I don't have silver, so it can only go to these. Get rid of this survival kit. Character tools. Oh, I should check that there's nothing in the survival in the assembler first. Right, we have a proper assembler at least. Okay, now. Uh... Yeah. So. For those of you wondering about this scenario, over there where it says space base, this is the never surrender scenario. It's a vanilla scenario. You trigger the start of the assault on that base when you get close. So as long as you keep your distance, you can spend as much time preparing as you like. Uh, to make this more interesting for a stream, I've said that Capac and I only have three hours. Uh, how do I convert this thing to a ship? You have to be in control of it to do so. I'm in the... And you really want to make sure you've got thrust in all directions before you do that, because you're in a gravity That's weapon. what I was just doing. But I'm in the control seat, but it's greyed out. Uh, you may not have full control of the enough control of the vessel yet for it to be considered yours. That could be the next issue you're running into. Uh, how do I know if I have enough control? You'll be able to change the name of the vessel and you'll be able to do that stuff. The other stuff you were trying to do. Uh, so, what, I just have to start grinding down stuff that's... Yep, and then converting it to you. You've got a good grinder though, so you should be able to do that fairly quickly. Uh, yes, Malcolm Hunter, I'm still calling the series Escape from Purgatory because it's more catchy than anything else I could come up with for it. Inventory full. So I figured I'd stick with it. Let's get a proper refinery built next, I think. I get more from stone from it. Unfortunately, though, since we haven't found any gold, I can't put yield modules on. Yeah, it's the purgatory system because everything orbits purgatory. Uh, or at least it looks that way when you look at all the planetary bodies around it. Events and button panels. Are you going okay in there, Capac? Yep. Good. We have about another just a bit under three hours oh boy two hours sorry oh good uh connect uh to be fair we've gotten to doors, having two ships both gyroscopes. almost functional in the time we've 
gone, so I think we've done pretty well. I don't think you need to stress. I'm stressing. You always Inventory stress. Full. Stress less. After all, you always say, what could possibly go wrong? Um, my precious stolen ship could get blown up. <laughs> it could. Well, as long as we can get you mobile and then cover this thing in turrets... Once I've got at least one of these refineries up, I think I might just stick to one refinery. I think two was getting a bit rich. One with speed modules should hopefully get us enough magnesium to build all the ammo. Uh, okay. How about, do you have any blocks around here I can grind down for stuff or have you already ground down everything? Well, I'm not, I'm not even worrying about parts. I'm just trying to get this thing Usable. Owned. Um. Oh, I can't even show where these things are in my hut. Can you see the other timer block? Uh. Maybe. What do you mean, maybe? <laughs> That's a yes or no question. Well, I thought I could see it, and I was right. I could. So the answer is yes. Um, okay, well, there was another LCD panel, oh, that would be the one inside. Uh, what else does Kavak need help finding? Those, those. This door. Okay, the only things left that are accessed tonight are one door, the hydrogen tank, and the battery. Um, but if oh, I... Oh yeah, we'll lose all the hydrogen if we grind it. Yeah. Do we... Do we have to grind everything to turn it into a ship? You have to grind enough that you own enough of it. Yeah, but what's, what's enough? Is that everything? No, it's not everything. Most. Because it's just the battery and the hydrogen tank left. I can convert it to ship. Apparently it's mine. What? I don't know. Can you share it to me now? I just gave it all to you. Uh. Well, I've got everything on it as share to faction. Have you just done it now? No. Just do it now, because I just transferred all my stuff to you and it doesn't immediately share that stuff. You have to share that. There you go. I transferred everything to you. No, don't! <sighs> what? the opposite of what I wanted. What are you talking wanted you about? Keep, wanted you to keep possession of it and then share it with me. But fine, I'll take ownership of it. Get in the pilot seat and I'll convert it to ship. And you'll see if you crash. But make sure your thrusters are on before you can. I can do the conversion. Well, they're on a toggle on the hopper. Where's the other ship? Uh... Here we go. Oh boy. Um, why are you what? digging? Because we're out of iron. What the? I thought, I thought you were on the other ship. No. You're controlling the other ship. Wait, you said it's you were going to convert it to a ship. I can. But were you ready? Yeah, yes. You didn't say you were ready. I said the thrusters are all on a hot bar. Yeah, but did you have them on yet? No. To turn them on. Right, I'm at the ship. I'm ready to press convert to ship. Jeez. All right. <laughs> Hurry up and do it and it explode so we can be done with this. Right, are you on board? I'm watching from a safe distance. No, get in the control seat because it may need to be rotated so that it doesn't fall to the planet. All right, fine. 
Are you in the control seat? Yes. Are you? Have you got the thrusters on? Yes. All right. Three, two, one. Converted. You are a ship now. Oh, why wouldn't that let me do it? It's so infuriating. Wait, why am I? Life likes to frustrate you. Why am I drifting sideways? Probably because you have no thruster in that direction. That's gravity as well. Oh, great. Yeah, your thruster on that side's off. I thought I'd fixed everything. Yeah, I still can't turn this one on. Oh, okay. Yeah, this... Wait. No, that oxygen should be passing it through. Because the thruster here is working, so all of these should be piped up. It's true. Still thinking it's owned by them though. Uh, let's just do this. Build you a nice fresh one. There, there we go. go. going on this. So, Capac, um, I think we should get out of the gravity well. Because we're burning power and fuel being in it. Alright, so head over to the magnesium asteroid. Yeah, I think that's a good spot, because it's got ice. Oh yeah, I should have put a welder next to the refinery so I don't have to pay babysit it. Thank you for the reminder. Just follow the trail of smoke. Didn't check, I hope that asteroid is outside the gravity well. Back over there. It just is outside, yep. Oh, good. So, Capac, you've got drills on your thing. Do you want to transfer them to this one? Uh, <clears throat> Considering this has got the refineries. I was thinking about keeping them for ramming things. Well, I feel like having them to collect resources faster might be more useful. Uh, where have you gone? Around to where the marker is. To the magnesium? Yeah. The MG ice oh, marker. Oh, there you are. Came around the other way. Yes. Yes, I did. Ah, uh, but yeah, I think we should transfer. Maybe don't need to transfer all of them, but two of them onto the top of the drill on the front of this. This only has two. Oh well, then all of them. Yeah. All right. Steal my drills. Well, it's so that we can make more guns. You steal the drills and I'll start patching up the armor and getting some more thrusters on here. Yeah, and then s picking where you're going to put all, all your guns. Don't think we're quite ready for you to make the guns yet, but it won't be too long. So I think if we arm yours up first and then try and focus on this one second, that is probably the way to go. 
So, where do you want these drills? Next to this one? On top of it. Uh, on top of it, like take off this armor block. No, no, this way is up, Kapak. What? Oh. Sure. Orientation via the cockpit. Typically the way ships are orientated. Nah. Uh oh. Where did I leave my ship parked? Oh, oh there it man, is. This refinery is so slow. That's a fair point, Takamiki. The Capac, you are going to need to try and take control of every block on that ship. Uh, well, it'll have to wait. I know. Inventory full. Uh, but you should try and take as many as you can. Because uh, otherwise, when I put guns on this ship, it'll shoot you. Nope, there's only two blocks left. The hydrogen tank and the battery. Uh, making new batteries shouldn't be much of a problem, but you'll probably want to cipher off all the siphon off all the hydrogen before we Okay. Alright, I'll build a hydrogen tank once this refinery's done, and then we can siphon it all off. Grind yours down, and then you can siphon it back so that you've got fuel. Uh yeah, Nick, the stream will be on available for you to watch straight after in fact if you're late and you wanted to you could watch <laughs> at two times speed and catch up from the very beginning come on I want to refine more stone more fast Order up other stuff at the moment, Kevak. Oh, it's just steel plates. Yeah, I know, but it gets produced before the steel tubes that I'm waiting on for the refinery. Because they require slightly less iron. Ore detectors. Don't need those. Okay, refinery's done. Now we're going to get more iron. Oh, actually, there's a there's a damaged battery on here. So if I repair that battery and set it to suck up all the charge, uh, then I can disassemble the other battery. You shouldn't. So you'll only need to replace a few power cells, and then you should get back exactly the power that the battery has. Really? Yep. Batteries retain their specified charge when they're repaired. It's really quite cool. Inventory full. Inventory full. Okay. I need a large cargo container. And a large hydrogen tank on this thing. Where's going to be a way to put it so they don't get in the way? I'll just build a bunch of small cargo containers. Hmm. Merge block. I don't need that. Uh, Stacks, this scenario has, I think, infinite rounds of drones that come after you. So it just, they keep coming until you die. Uh, so there are achievements, like Steam achievements, for getting put through a hundred, a thousand, um, I think it's ten, a hundred and a thousand waves of drones. I have not gotten through a hundred or a thousand of them. 
Thanks, mechanized imposter. Under the original cargo, yeah, I can put some more there too. I think just putting lots of little ones is the way to go. Inventory full. Yeah, Kenneth, that's pretty awesome. Uh, thank you to everyone who's come along to celebrate this ending of an era for Kapak and I. And the start of a new era. A better era. Hopefully. How come I've only got two drills? Didn't you add a third? Huh? Um, no. The, the parts... Oh, there weren't enough parts for the... Yeah, there wasn't quite one. enough to make another drill. Okay, that's fine. Two should be enough anyway. The ones on mine weren't. One of them was very badly damaged. Yep. That's cool. Now I can fill up. Uh, no, Jason. The... Sunflower thing I built on Twitch as for part of the Assertive Cargo Ships mod. Uh, a beacon would not have worked in place of the antenna. Um, because the ship needs to be able to transmit and receive with the way I set the mod up because I wanted it to be that way. So, for those of you who, don't, who haven't seen me messing around with that mod on Twitch recently, the Assertive mod that's active in Survival Impossible and in Escape from Purgatory and that we used in Survival Unlikely. Uh, it has gotten a few upgrades recently and I've been working on a bunch more that includes a whole raft of new behaviours including the ability of, for the cargo ships to call for aid from the nearby bases. So if a base is nearby, the cargo ships can actually go and put a call out over their antenna and nearby bases will send additional drones to help them out. Which I think is going to be pretty nasty and pretty cool. Am I hearing this right? What? Did you not let the chat put a sombrero on the ship you were building and instead you just put an antenna? Yes. That is unacceptable. Is... <laughs> yes, but if you ever meet that ship, Kapak, there is a, um, a whatchamacallit, a data pad in it that will ex that uh, has a bit of fun at the expense of that. Uh, right, what else can I strip off this thing? Do I need hydrogen engines? I probably need them to recharge at this point, I guess. Uh, yeah. Ice is our only real source of meaningful power production at the moment. Thanks, Keith. Glad you've enjoyed it. Inventory full. Uh, Shambalion, there it is impossible for me to give you a config to change the aggro range. That is not an option. Because it is not a config built into Rival AI or Modular Encounters. Uh, uh, I guess you'll have to see, Cage. I think it's time-based. But I can't remember whether the drones are just time-based or whether there's something else that triggers them. Wait, why is... Why is what? You're not getting oxygen. I'm not getting hydrogen. Are we out of ice? Don't know. Yeah. Uh, well, that's not good. No. Uh, I shall go grab some ice. So it might help if you'd actually ever finish that tank you're building on top. Well. 
I never built the tank on top. I can't get any materials to build with. Why not? Because you keep stealing them all. Because I need them to make more materials. Alright. There's another Mayday if you wanted to go check it out, Kamek. No, uh, I've seen that. It keeps sort of appearing and disappearing. Alright, I'm going to go around to the ice. Grab some. Alright, the hydrogen tank's built. Fuel low. Where is the ice? Oh no, the drone waves in this scenario are not a mod, it's a vanilla scenario. Uh, it's I've got a scenario. full tank on my ship, but I don't know... Uh, well, if you turn, because we don't have access to the tank, you can't use it to fill up in a bottle yeah. or anything. Yeah, don't have a way to fill up from it. And there's no survival kit on that grid that you can use either. Oh, there's a loose armor block. Wait, come back. I need loose armor block. I need your plates. Yeah, so if you, if you want to play this scenario, you just go to your menu and you start the never oh. surrender scenario. I should really add a, have added lights to the front of this. So those bits of rock are not nicely placed and very dark. Thanks, Eldek. I might just put a light on the front here for a second. This is kind of terrifying me, but I can't see. I do have a light, it's just not set to go very far. Let's get another one. Uh, nope. We don't have any bottles to refill. We've only got suits. Yeah, neither of us have made any yet. And even if we did have bottles, we can't refill them Fuel using Kavak's low. tank because he doesn't own it yet. You've got to own it to be able to change the values on it to allow it to refill the bottles and you've got to own it to be able to access it. Access its inventory. There we go. Topped up. It might be worth for you to move around here. What? Ship. I'm around here. No, but move your ship around here. Yeah, it's over here. All right, you did do it. Did I just kind of do a circle around you or something? What? No, I followed you around. Oh, cool. All right, let's get some of these speed modules on here. Get through this stone quickly. I can mine some more. Uh, what am I going to do with this thing? With what thing? The ship. Guns. Right. Lots of guns. I'm going to finish patching up these armor bits. Alright, 
how can I basic refinery shovel the cobalt into it and hopefully I don't need to get I won't get so much done of the other one. Oh, I know what the problem is. That cargo container. I think this is the one that's getting pulled from first. Without a sorter, I don't think I can fix this. Now, Kabak, you... I need to add a large hydrogen tank to this, don't I? Uh, yeah. Because then I can siphon off yours and you can take ownership of your tank. Yep. Yep. All right. I'll probably add one just here and then move my thrusters back. Need to start getting some magnesium refined, though. In fact, what I might do... Uh... Do that. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Uh, talking beans, Capac and I have played a little bit of Don't Starve together. Just not streamed or recorded or anything. Um, we're both pretty terrible at it. And Space Engineers is not the only thing we're going to end up playing today. So once we get over to Twitch, we're going to have you guys vote on it. And Don't Starve Together was one of the games we put in the list that can be voted on. We might end up playing it. Because we know we're so bad, um, we know it'll probably only last about an hour or two. Hmm. If that. Sound accurate, Kamak? Yeah. <laughs> you, you said yes to that so much quicker than you usually respond to things. I was prepared. <laughs> You're saying it took me a while to get to my point. What? No. Quit asking questions. But that that's how we talk about things. Mm. How we make interesting content that people want to listen to. No, they don't want to see that. They just want to see me die. <laughs> 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 need a lot of large <laughs> tubes to make Thanks, a Kate. big tank. Uh. Oh, man. Oh, Capac, at least you know what your role is. Thanks, Blade Dancer. <laughs> I don't think we can keep being anyone but us. <laughs> Thanks, man. Oh, I wish I didn't have to babysit these refineries. That's really annoying. Uh, if it makes you feel any better, I've got the hydrogen tank situation covered. Oh, did you make a second tank on yours? Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm working then... on it. Okay. You, yeah, that probably is a lot easier than me building one on here. Um, all right. Time to... Spam some batteries. <laughs> Thanks, I got. Apparently, we play off each other like Laurel and Hardy. I think, in a lot of ways, Capac and I, through no planning whatsoever, ended up in a friendship where we kind of fit that stereotype of um, male friends that just give each other constant pain. A laurel and hardy handshake. Is there is there like a writer's term for what I'm talking about, Capac? What? A comedic duo? Yeah, that standard pair. The straight-laced and the wacky. Oh, I need infinite steel plates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need lots of stuff. Uh, maybe I can... Pinky and the brain. Yes. I, I actually 
subscribe to the Pinky and the Brain one because I, I think that fits quite nicely to both of us. How do you feel about being Pinky, Kamak? Um, I mean, it's not the most flattering. But it's not the most insulting either because Pinky was actually pretty smart sometimes. He just most of the time chose not to be. That's just what they say to his face to make him feel better. Inventory. No, there were times where he actually did sensible things. Hmm, do I need these oxygen tanks? I need to get to this container. How do I get to that one? You are going to need some oxygen. Probably not a lot. When I first saw one of Splitzy's videos, I thought Splitzy was the engineer and Capac was the guy with the gun. So, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Exactly, Psycho. That's why they didn't ever reveal which the crazy one was out of Pinky and the Brain. Container 03. Oh, you're going for stone. Come on, too much cobalt. I'm kind of tempted to build a disconnected cargo container. I think I will after this battery, and then I can move all the cobalt over there temporarily. So it stops getting refined, so I can stop babysitting these refineries. Container 05. Container 13. Hmm. Have you got it showing on HUD or anything? No, I can't because I don't own it. Oh, yeah, of course. You're talking about that stuff. I wonder hmm. how this is going to go. We've got... Almost 10 kilos of magnesium. Woo! We're going to need so much more. Ugh. I need this Energy cobalt out of here. Now. We've got more than enough cobalt for everything we need. I think we've got... 345... Yeah. We've got almost a ton of cobalt. We do not need more. Feels wasteful to throw this away if I don't. <clears throat> we end up needing some cobalt later, but I'm pretty sure we're not going to need more than a thousand uh, metal grid. Oops. All right, I've okay. emptied the old tank. This means I don't need to babysit. Okay, now I can mine some stone, get some refined quickly. Time remaining, an hour and 15. 
think we're going to be okay. Ish. At least for the first few rounds. Certainly better than one of the earlier attempts Gapak and I made at this where we had small Inventory grid stuff. Full. At least large grid will have the range advantage with our turrets. Have you started putting some turrets on, Kapak? No. Alright, you should start thinking about that soon. Right now I'm working on trying to get Inventory enough iron quickly full. that we can make all that steel plate you want for armor. And that I'm going to want for armor. <laughs> Thanks, Tuckbone. Good to see you again, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the last time we streamed, Capac still had his potato. Last time we streamed on YouTube. What? No, seriously, I think the last time I streamed on YouTube, you still had your potato. Well, we, you did, like, Jackbox streams on the YouTubes. Yeah, but that was on Zebra Monkeys, not on my channel. Oh. Yeah. Now you've got the sweet potato. Alright, I fixed the battery... No, I fixed the hydrogen problem. Now I've got to fix the battery problem. Well, at least this production's going quickly. I think Kapak is the Woodley to Splitsy's Lano. How do you feel about that one, Kapak? Uh, I haven't watched any of their stuff in an awfully long time. Yeah, I saw Woodley on... Was it Lano? No, I thought it was Woodley. On some... Thing on Netflix not that long ago. Or on... No. On Amazon. Um, but it was just kind of awkward. It wasn't particularly funny. Uh, Mirko, if you were trying to be ultra efficient, you could separate the drills and have them a bit further apart, but in this instance, the time it takes to build is more important than the optimization of drilling. Because I think one of those takes a lot longer to do than the other. And Lucas feels like an Angry Beavers reference works for both of us. And thanks, Tristan. Come on. Build the stuff. Take all the time you need. When ready, go to one of the locations displayed on your HUD. Your task is to defend that location to the best of your ability. No, I don't want to go to a location. Sounds dangerous. Uh, it will be very dangerous. But you're an elite mercenary, aren't you? Uh, what? <laughs> what do you always say you are? I need more computers. Alright, the assembler has four speed modules, the refinery has four speed modules, and I'm just progressively adding batteries. What? What do you mean access denied? What's access denied? This battery. Did you grind it down far enough? Uh, apparently not. Inventory full. Okay. How oh, is this holding up for power with both of those running? Oh, four years. I think we're going to be okay. Although that is with the hydrogen engine running. Still think power is not going to be our problem here. Problem is going to be getting more magnesium and more iron because we can only use stone. Well, that's going to take a while. What's that? Uh, this battery to recharge. Ah. Yeah, Skippy. Are you, po are you pondering what I'm pondering, Capac? 
I think so. But how do we get the drones to wear their pretty pink dresses, and where would we even buy ones that would fit? Mm. I used to like watching Pinky in the Brain when we came home from school. We'd have to, uh, have to find a station somewhere that sells drone clothes. Ah, uh, yeah, Fuzzball, I'm aware the, um, hydrogen engine is on, and I have left it on, because I don't have any other means to generate additional power other than adding more batteries. I'm kind of doing both. Uh, oh yeah. Hydrogen tank's half full, that's fine. That'll be enough. That'll be plenty. Plenty, plenty, plenty. Thanks, don't blame me. Uh, magnesium. Let's get some more. Uh, come back, don't mind me. I'm just flying away to the magnesium again. Leaving me behind. Yep. We need to refine more because we need to be able to make some ammo. And soon. Because I believe we are almost down to the final hour. Before we must head oh dear. to the space base. Um, only 11% charge. Thanks, Bernard. <laughs> and thanks, Carson. Uh, how are we going, drills? How are we going for magnesium or... Refinery, refinery. All right, production. Let's make some ammo before I forget to have any made. Okay. Battery situation is sorted. Uh huh. Good. Uh, is is there anything on your ship that you don't own? I think there's still some. I think there's some cargo containers. I can't see. Yep, here we go. No, they. It looks like they're they're all fine though. Ah, here we go. Uh, connector oxygen generators. Thanks, Dustin. Oxygen tanks. There. Alright, I've made... Well, actually, I've made a decent amount of ammunition, actually. That's not too bad. That Got one's... 50 containers already. Uh, this is not a public server. This is a locally hosted game with a vanilla scenario. Okay, so what I want to do is put a cargo container there. Maybe another one. Oxygen tanks yeah. and one more oxygen generator. That'll be these fellas. Let's go this. I th I'm trying to think of how I'm going to armor the rear end of this ship at the moment. One o two. Check the refinery. Is it's high value? I think this will be a decent start.
Yeah, we're not going to have time to do heavy armor, so light armor is the best we're going to do. I'm not even going to make an attempt at heavy. Attempting heavy, I think, will just mean that we'll have a few small spots of armor and nothing else. Where's this other oxygen tank? Is it this one? <laughs> you a bit lost, Kamak. I'm trying to... Step back. Uh, I think at some point it may reach that moment where we have to decide are we going to cheat to allow you to get access, control of, over everything or leave you floundering over there for much longer. Uh, the Hmm. Hmm? Do you think you own everything yet? There's one O2 tank. Which Is it one? An, one of the unbuilt ones? Inventory. There were a few unbuilt ones. Let's see. It's not that one. It's... Not those two, so yeah, it must be this one. Okay. Uh, nope. Still... Is there a tank hidden here somewhere? I can't see it. Also, this needs to have a more interesting color. Let's go red. Underneath. Uh, let's stick with the blue. Let's stick with the blue and white. Thanks, oh. Mr. Jabba and Justin. Thanks again. Sneaky. Alright, I got it. Everything's transferred. Wait. Good job. Get these built so I can stick a turret on top. Yep, there we go. So I can access these thruster components now. Cool. Don't know what 80 thruster components buys me. Uh, it buys me another ion thruster. Um, because I've got all ion on this thing. Yeah, where have you got to? I'm over by the magnesium. Oh, there you are. I might just make this thing a bit of a tube for now. Inventory Although that's going to have to bulge up for. Uh, Inventory that one, full. then. Fine, I'll go smokestack like Kavak wanted. Inventory full. I can get even half of this built, it'd be nice. Inventory full. Oops, too bad. Inventory full. full. Inventory full. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Ghost Rider, definitely a good idea to learn the basics before jumping into Never Surrender. I mean, you sort of can learn the basics in this scenario and then just go to the base to defend it when you feel you're ready because uh, you don't have to go there straight away and then at least you got the scripting in the save that you're playing
Oh, one hour. One hour to go, Capac. One hour remains. No, oh, it's not enough time. Uh. Huh. I need a shameful display. Hey, quit moving around. I'm worried we're gonna run out of iron trying to get all these steel plate done. Oh. <laughs> How have we done so much in two hours? Uh, practice. Some of you might have watched the stream where I raced, wasted, and shack. And I started on Titan, they started on the North Pole, and we were racing to the South Pole of the Earthlight. And I almost won. I have practiced this quick start a few times. Because it's kind of fun to see how quickly you can do it. Uh, it wasn't particularly recent, but there were I did put the edited versions of the first bit up on this channel. Uh, the bits that I didn't get around to editing are over on you, my second channel, which is youtube.com forward slash flipsy. I keep going to that cargo container that I can't actually access stuff from. Oops. Uh, let's grab some white paint. Yeah, Talking Beans, it was really fun uh, doing that race with Wasted and Shaq. It's really hard to find a race like that that works and all participants have fun though. Because we can't really do the Top Gear thing of staging it all or doing it all in editing to make it look like it's close even when it was actually days separate in time. Uh... But yeah, it was fun. Well, it was a lot of fun. All right, let's see. <laughs> Thanks, Sean. Yeah, I can't I can't help but trying to make things look at least a little interesting. Inventory full. Call this the blue submarine. Sure. <laughs> it does look a bit like that. Uh I think these should go white. Then what I'm going to do is put... Turret. Pretty sure that's safe. Turret and turret. It's a bit of a start. Thanks, Jackson. Oh, this is... At least I can try and face this side to the enemy. <laughs> face this... Face towards enemy. 
this face towards enemy? What does it say on claymores? Uh, this side to enemy? Full. Something like that. This is going to be a bit boring for parts of this design, though. Necessary, though. Just so I can get this done quickly. Actually, that's a fair point. Capac, we probably should put some small, like, some interior turrets on as well. Inventory. Yeah, uh, but just set them to take out missiles. Erg. Um. <laughs> of course, Mr. Shaba. <laughs> no worries at all. Front towards enemy. That's it. All right, how's the refinery going? Let's get some more stone in. Make sure we don't run out of iron making all this plate. I might need to mine some more stone. Got 121 magnesium. That's another 100 ammunition containers. Uh, I will make 100 of those and another. Nope, that's not what I meant to click on. And another 100 of those. And a couple of thousand of those. And another one of those. And how about one of these? And a little bit of that. Sorry, cat back. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that to you. Huh? Me just talking like that. No, that's but fine. Poking fun at. I'm used to it. <laughs> Jeez. Just let's see, gibbering wow. away in the background. Harsh. Make it sound like I try and ignore you, which is what you do to me. All right, I think I'm getting somewhere. We're at like 50 minutes, Kahak. Okay. Hope you've started making guns. Uh, I've started making the mounts for some guns. Start making the actual guns. I've made, I haven't made any guns yet, but you were supposed to be the one going into the line of fire first. What the you, space gravel? You've done a fair bit of armor, right? 
I've done a oh. little bit of armor. What was okay, that? That turret does not is not safe where I put it. Gotcha. Need to move that thruster. What? What? Mm. What's wrong? You keep moving the ship while I'm trying to get things. You keep coming back when I go to mine stuff. Oh, I've got a feeling this is not going to go very well. Us fighting the, the drones. Yep. It's going to go very poorly indeed. Why do you think it's going to go poorly? Because it's right up going. I'm not even going to have any guns. That's why. What have, what have you done to your ship? I kind of want to check, but I kind of want to don't want to stop doing stuff. Ooh, you've made it quite sleek. You shrunk you shrunk it a bit, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good call. But I'm not getting parts fast enough. Well, you need to move your ship closer so you can... Although I'm going to have to move around to the ice again, I think. Because I don't think we're getting any more hydrogen from the survival kit. Yeah, we're out of ice. And I let all the hydrogen go into the engine. Uh, what's down there? Something's still damaged. <laughs> so, Patrick Sam's just said, let's take a vote 30 extra minutes and derpy penguin immediately replied 30 less minutes no not 30 less minutes 30 less minutes would be bad hey capac ship looks better than mine because capac ship actually started as a ship of this scale that's uh, a skill and that is true carson i do most of the talking you're right this capac often sits there just Groaning about something or other. Yeah, how are you stealing all the good parts and I've got nothing left to build with? <laughs> hey, I built a system to get us as much stuff as I could without doing too much. It was a balance. I didn't want to build too many assemblers and refineries and things and end up not being able to build anything. Perfectly balanced, too much time. as all things should be. Pack, you've started something I didn't want you to start. What? Now people are saying that I just do all the talking and don't even give you a chance to speak. I have to fill the empty voids, otherwise no one will. I mean, I can never get a word in edgewise. Just such Urge a chatterbox. why I get the parts and you don't. This Capac still doesn't use Build Planner, despite me having shown him my tutorial on it. 
I didn't watch it. Uh, I've actually watched you watch it. What? Yeah. When I first made it, you watched it because you wanted to find out how to use it. And then you never have used it. It still doesn't make sense. There are some things that not even Splitzy can make comprehensible. <laughs> now remember guys, when we get to the facility, I think we get a few minutes of prep time before it gets attacked as well. So it won't just be these three hours. We'll get, I think, maybe another 15 minutes or something. So hopefully that'll be enough for us to finish off any prep work that we need to do. there are any large grid drones that come after us so I can probably just turn off targeting large grid then I won't then I definitely won't accidentally shoot Kapak's ship although his ship's in range and they're not shooting him so that's fine I have three turrets Kapak I have one and a bit oh that's something progress is being, being made I have two. Uh, right. I need to try and get these bits of armor down the side and a couple of turrets on the side here too. <laughs> it's almost painful watching Kapak go to a cargo container 20 times to build one turret. <laughs> I mean, if it makes you feel any better, it's that taking that long for the motors to manufacture anyway. So it's not like I've hey. got anything better to do with my time. Those of you who are watching Capac stream, is he going to this cargo container that I keep going to? The one that's not piped because it's full of cobalt? Yep. Because <laughs> I didn't want to have to process the cobalt, but I didn't want to throw it away. But I probably should just throw it away. Going well, I feel. Hydrogen's holding up at the moment, but I need to keep an eye on my jetpack fuel and capac. Have you got your thing set up so that you can refuel at your ship? For your jetpack? Nope. Okay. Suppose I should go get some ice soon then. I should probably just get rid of this. How much iron have we got? That's not how you spell iron. Oh. Okay. Got too much magnesium. I'm gonna go around and grab some ice, Capac. Okay. I can't remember which way I need to go though. Oh, 
I'm going to need more batteries too. I've only got 37 minutes of power. Yes, you can tell what Kabak built on this thing with the big, bright orange nose. Probably fix that. I'm trying to think of how many guns I had when I fought the Never Surrender thing before. Whether we're got more this time? I'm pretty sure we do. Uh, hydrogen generators are full. And we got some excess ice. Good. Where have we gone now? Uh, we could have gotten lucky and found... I'm at the ice. And found uranium, but we didn't... And we didn't find silver either for reactor components. Or gold for superconductor components. So... We're just sticking with the simple stuff. Wait, what ice? There's ice on this asteroid. I'm just around the other side of the asteroid. magnesium have we got left? Ugh, still got heaps. Uh, have you made any small ammos? Uh, probably. Uh, I got a hundred. Nigel, that's not going to happen. I'm not going to be dead in the water. It'll be fine. Stone refined. You know what I might do? I'm going to continue using this container to store stuff I don't want refined, and I'm going to take this magnesium out temporarily. Get a bunch more stone refined, and then come back to this. Oh, is that full? Crap. No. I have to refine some of the magnesium. <laughs> Build some spotlights. Uh, okay. Fair enough. Oh, I should have put high-powered spotlight mod on. Dang it. That's a useful one without being cheaty. Inventory full. And All right. 
how's my power now? I've got that additional battery. How much this is... That's still got 19%. That's fine. Uh, two hours of power. That's enough. Weird having a definitive end point for when I can just let the power run out. Need stone refined. Uh, let's make another hundred of those. Another hundred of those. Ah, uh, yeah, a few of the batteries don't have lights on because they're below 25%. But if you look on Build Vision, they still say 19.8%. So they've got something. Almost at the half hour mark, Kavak. Yep. I don't know what to do at the front here. I'm just going to place down what little armor I can build. I think I might just put a quick side bit on here. Something like this should at least provide a little bit of protection. It's not going to do a lot and it might deform and do damage to parts inside but at least if we can deflect a few shots That'll help. Uh, in fact, have I got any way to put a cargo point coming out this side? I don't think I do, because that cargo container is not connected. I just have to go turrets top and bottom. Isn't too bad. Thanks, Carson. So who else thinks he'll be dead in the water an hour from now and there'll be an echo of don't coming of Dow coming from Kapak, an angry Kapak somewhere in the background. <laughs> no, it won't be that bad. Oh, we're out of stone. No, I'm not going to be dead in the water. It'll be fine. Confident. Kapak and I will both make it to the fight. We'll both fight. We'll fight and we'll win. Come on, you apes. You want to live forever? We might, we might manage to survive long enough for this stream to go over YouTube's um, four-hour DVR thing. Maybe. What? Four-hour <laughs> DVR? You know how they've got the DVR function on YouTube so that you can actually start a stream from the beginning even if it's midway? Oh. Which Twitch doesn't do. Um, that's what stops you from... Uh, that's why a lot of people don't stream for longer than four hours on YouTube. Because if they do, then the people joining late have to start a few minutes in. I see. Because uh, the DVR only goes for four hours. And then they have to wait 
for that initial bit until all the processing is done on the whole stream. And I think are we going for iron now? Five thousand iron. That's something. Uh, are we producing any steel plate? No. No, no, not solar panels. Love them solar panels. Oh no, the assembler's full of gravel. This is the time where I regret not building that gravel ejector that was suggested earlier on. But, and again, if I'd done it, I would have spent time on it. And resources. Yeah, I hate it when my machinery gets all gummed up with gravel too. Oops. There you go, gravel ejected. Ah, uh, the death score's quite low so far. Capac on two, me on zero. Unless you count the ones where we died before anything really started. In which case, it's three and one. But we're going with two Energy and zero. Low. Ah. What's ah. I armored up my bridge, and now it's kind of difficult to get to it. <laughs> No, we are not on a server. I am local hosting this. Uh, whoops. Uh, that sounded didn't loud. Sound good. Hoping that was just the gravel and not me smashing the drills into the asteroid. Capac, do you think it'd be better for us to have both ships in the fight from the beginning, or should we hold one back as a reserve? Uh, probably. Oh, hmm. Yeah, I'm torn. Holding one if back might <laughs> make our inevitable demise drag out longer. Yeah. I was thinking, like, maybe if I held this one back so we can keep getting the stuff to repair yours and both of us ride on your ship with me acting sort of as repair crew oh boy because then we can repair it in between things with all the production facilities on this and by hold back I mean you just charge in to whichever direction the attack's coming from and we just leave this one stationed over the facility. Yeah. They're not like 10 k's away or something. Okay, that should do for a bit. Uh, are you trying to build your large thruster? I already built my large thruster. And I'm trying to build some maneuvering thrusters. You ordered up an awful lot of stuff. Well, I'm almost done. Uh.
Huh? I wonder. I wonder if it's being suggested in chat that uh, we build something like my sandbags from Swivel, maybe like a basic battery turret and a little bit of armor that we just lay down a few of those around the place as well. Uh, we run out of time for such shenanigans. Yeah, I think better to focus on making the ships more effective. Or more resilient, at least. If we get time during the prep phase once we're over there, then yeah, I might do something like that. But the ships aren't finished, so I think they're better. Time is better spent on them. Right. I've got my maneuvering thrusters. I think I'm just going to focus on getting some more armor up. I managed to build a really ugly armor design that covers some of the ship. Maybe a third of it. Inventory full. Oh, I forgot to add the Capac decoy mod. I could have put Capacs all over my hull to get shot. Hey. What? You're rude. Inventory <laughs> full. This is the best welder I can get. We don't have any silver, so I can't make the better ones. I would have to break down some thruster components. Kabak, did you say you still had some thruster components over on your ship as well? Uh, I transferred them all over to your ship. Okay, cool. So I can add an extra thruster. Sweet. Oh, I guess I gotta do it. I gotta do it. You gotta do, do what? Uh, what are you doing? Info, grid name. Oh yeah, what are you naming it? The hot dog. The hot dog? Yep. Okay. Because it's in... Uh, white, red, and yellow. Uh-huh. Looking very ketchup and mustardy. And let's see, I'll go some armor over here. And also, it's in honor of the pilot hot dog from Battlestar Galactica. Is that so? Yeah. You didn't only just think of that? No. Let's just fill in this gap with some armor blocks. Oh yeah, range. Have you maxed the range on your turrets? Yeah. You'll also want to make sure you have somewhere on your hot bar the ability to turn off your turrets because they will keep shooting stuff that we don't need to waste ammo on. Yeah, okay. We have to make sure that's not a problem for us. 20 minutes remaining! 20 minutes remaining and Capac's ship has how many guns? I've got two main turrets and four point defense turrets. And I have five, six, I'm going to have seven main turrets. I think mine's probably going to be a little more maneuverable than yours, so... A lot more. That's why I've gone heavy on the turrets, because uh, with this being all ions, 
it's got no maneuverability at all, pretty much. Uh, yes, I'm going to need to make some more ammo, too. What the... What am I even looking at over here? What have you done to this poor ship? Uh, horrible, horrible things. In the service of war. Uh, do not have an extra gyro, but probably should. They're just really expensive. stone got the hydrogen engine on I think I think I turned it back on before yep got the ugliest but most heavily fortified ship Target large ships off. Able idle off. Range is at 800. Well, Capac, hopefully we'll have enough stuff on board this to do some repairs to the facility that's there as well. Not just keeping our ships up and running. Yep, Splitzy has built a slightly rounded brick. This is true. And he is not happy about it. I'm pretty happy with what I got going over here. Yeah, your hull started a lot better for something of this scale. I'm also kind of impressed with the bits that you culled to make it a bit more sleek and small. to just add armor for the sake of armor nice and quick my oh yeah, junkyard wars was a great show i really liked that oh wait that's not gonna work okay um oh Time remaining, 16 minutes. Kapak and I have to start moving over there straight away as soon as that timer runs out. Alright, what can we do here? Let's get rid of that. Uh, yeah, Daniel Barrett, we are not, Kapak and I are not going to be housemates anymore. We... But we are going to have a shared office space that we have leased together. But we'll still be able to make the content the way that we want to. Jeez. I do not have time to greeble, but I can't help myself. Just make it functional greeble. What I'm trying to do.
<laughs> you should get some of those USB missile launchers for your office just in case. Yes! At some point we should do a battle with something like that. That would be hilarious. I've always wanted one of those. Uh. Hmm. What are you humming? I think this is about as good as it's going to get. If you're happy with your ship, I would Inventory appreciate some help full. welding up armor on this thing. Yeah. Perhaps if you could start at the front. I don't really care what shape you do. Just as long as it gets some armor. And if you think you can fit an extra turret in there, that wouldn't be bad. Or if you think it'd be more useful, you can put in some interior turrets around the place because I haven't got any on here yet. Hello there. Would you like a banana? I know there are only rockets in SE, but they call them missiles, so I can't break the habit. I blame Keen. <laughs> uh... The kookaburras apparently agree, because they're laughing. Damn kookaburras. Or like, he doesn't even know the difference between a rocket and a missile. <laughs> Thank you for implying that they're laughing at me. Uh, motors. Motors. Twelve minutes. Yeah. I'm pretty impressed with what we've managed to construct in this zone. And very pleased that Kapak went to investigate the uh, ship that he found. Yep. <laughs> that worked out well. Very well. Lucky you have experience not dying to those things. As well as dying to those things. here. Whatever. This is just going to be asymmetrical. We'll cope. I may well, if people remind me at some point in the future, take this ship. Oh, actually, if people remind me to blueprint it before we go into battle, but take this ship and turn it into a proper ship with some style uh, for the Assertive Cargo Ships mod. Or what will soon be called the Assertive Combat Systems mod, because it's not just cargo ships. Thanks, Iron Dan. That's true. Rockets are missiles. I think a lot of people in, like, the context of stuff like Space Engineers call missiles things that have a, the ability to guide themselves. But you're right. Thanks, Iron Dan. Rockets technically are missiles. Uh, I think any kind of projectile is exactly. a missile. That's the point that he was making. But not every kind of missile is a rocket. Also true. Uh, 
Okay. Maybe I'll fit another turret on the top there, but that's about it. Uh, do we have any stone left? No. Hey, Tex. How's it going? You've come at a very good time, because I believe we have nine minutes until we have to go fight. Oh, no. Yep. And I have built possibly one of the ugliest ships I've ever constructed. Run away! Run away! Run away! Uh, but hopefully it has enough guns to be useful. I think this is one of the best ships I've ever constructed. In fact, I'm going to blueprint it right now. I wonder how Aragath feels about designing most of the ship that you built. What? He doesn't need to know about that. <laughs> I mean, and it's pretty unrecognizable at this point. Uh, hmm. Can I answer that before we start fighting? How did we end up on YouTube, Kempak? How did we end up starting making Light Echoes five years ago? Well, I mean, during the 80s, uh, like, the Department of Defense was working on the system of networked computers. Oh dear. <laughs> I figured you'd go for something like that. Um, right, I guess the story of how we started on YouTube was we were, <laughs> we briefly entertained the idea of making some kind of video game and we decided it was too hard and we do YouTube instead. <laughs> that is an accurate description. Uh, how are you doing for ammo? And how much of it have you been taking? Um, I've got... What is it there's called? Like, NATO. There's like 200 just in cargo containers here. I should probably make some more. One, two... Wait a minute. What? There's a lot of ammunition over here. It's Why can answer. I only see... I can only see two of these turrets. Seven minutes. Is this not piped? It's gotta be- it's definitely piped. Hmm. Brian says, hardy, har, har, good answer, Kapak. Uh, to your origin story. Oh, I've just messed that up. That's not good. This needs to go somewhere else. Five minutes. Yeah. Five minutes. Right, I've got a full load on each of my guns. Cool. Just Have you got any, uh, any, in, any spare? And only a, a handful. Okay. Um, did you fill the the turrets yourself, or did you let them fill themselves? Uh, I filled them open. all through the piping system, so yeah. it should, they should all yeah, be they connected. All, uh, they all max themselves out anyway, which is annoying because that means when they get destroyed we lose all that ammo. Alright, 
production. Let's make enough stuff for a bunch of turrets. Well, we might want to just start grinding out ammo now, though. Uh, we've got quite a lot of ammo. I think if a full load is 24... Eesh. I got three guns, so I've got two full loads over here. Okay. Um, hmm. This design of yours certainly is something. Yeah, it's pretty ugly. It is pretty dang ugly. Now, if you move the cockpit round to this other side, it'd look kind of like a fish. <laughs> Would that make it better? Um, anything's better if it looks like a fish. <laughs> Three minutes remaining. Oh yeah, I'm going to keep building on our way to the thing, and I'm going to keep building once we get there during the prep time we've got there. But Capac's going to be spending his time repairing the facility. It's there, I think. So what, once my ship gets blown up? No, no, no. Before the first round, a wave arrives. Oh. Because we have a bit of time. Um. No, nope. go away. <laughs> go away, grab all. Why didn't I throw you further away? All right, two minutes. Oh, yeah, Tex, this is the keen never surrender scenario. The vanilla one. This, this seems like a bit of a weak spot in the armor here. Where you enter? Yeah. Yep. There's not much else I can do. Unless you want to help me get some little turrets on the outside. What the? Oh, leave. Okay. We need to blueprint this soon. Um, how about can you help put ammo in these? This will be the last one. There we go. Uh, ammo. Uh, if you just search for 5.5. .5. Oh, we need more. How much yeah. did you put in yours? Uh, I've got 50 per gun. Well, that's a lot. Yeah, it, it, it'll chew through it pretty quick. Oh, it's more that if they get destroyed, we lose it all. But it should be fine. I'm transferring the magnesium I'd already mined into the thing to get refined, because we need more magnesium. Yeah, yeah, I've heard you guys about the blueprint. And time is up. Come back. Oh no. Up in your ship. Let's get rolling. Oh, don't crash into me, jeez. Uh, where is it? This way. Uh, where are we going? Space base? 
Yep. Space base. Off we go. Whoa! Don't! Jeez. You don't need to go so fast. I'm going to be miles behind you now. Show off with your giant hydrogen thruster. <laughs> I'm a speed demon. <laughs> it's going to take me off. I'm going to be accelerating up until I get halfway there and then I decelerate the rest of the time. Okay. Well, we've got a lovely smoke trail to align myself with. What? I've got some kind of damage component that's leaving a trail of smoke. <laughs> okay, it's blueprinted. these to cap out get ammo in. None. Oh yeah, there, there wasn't any uh, stuff made yet. Bets I won't decelerate in time. Hey, that's not something I've ever done on a stream before. No, never. Even mere minutes after I said, never fly straight at an asteroid. That's a bad idea. That was one of the first things I learned in Space Engineers. Yep, me too. Um, it's going to be... Um, yeah, it's just one of those things that you always have to learn but yeah the time that I did it in the learning to survive scenario on stream where I crashed my entire ship into an asteroid and I will leave actually we'll drop that down to 400 target missiles target small ships Now I have some anti-missile defense. Uh, Capac's arrival Ooh. will trigger the countdown. Hold on a sec. Oh, that's not good. What? Uh, I'm short a thruster. In one direction? Yeah. Uh, that isn't good. <laughs> did I say that? <laughs> Takamiki, over a thousand hours in Space Engineers and I did the number one thing you should never do flying in space. Pointing straight at the object you were flying towards. Oh boy. How far are you from the thing, Kavak? I'm almost there. I'm still 11Ks out. Uh, oh. That might not be good. Uh, is there a source of oxygen on this base somewhere? Uh, probably. Probably should have topped up before I blasted off. Maybe. Oh, that's what I should do. Production. Decoy. Hey, Richard Joy. Thanks, man. Uh, I'm going to make enough stuff that we can just put some decoys on the asteroid around the place. Come back. Yeah. Though, because these drones wave in four minutes... Oh boy. You better start repairing, Kapak, because you're the only one there. I'm still 5Ks out. Uh, there's a bunch of ice. Surely you've got some oxygen for me. Nope. No, you don't. 
Um, magnesium well, power generator. What's that? It says there's a magnesium power generator. Uh, no, send next wave doesn't sound fun. There is a little bit of ammo here. Yeah, just repair stuff. But I need oxygen. I'm looking for well, oxygen. I'm almost there. You were the one who did this to yourself. Oh, there's an O2H2 generator here. Need steel plates and large steel tubes. Capac, I'm a kilometer out. You can come to me and get oxygen if you want. I am traveling at 55 meters a second though. There's some bits here. I uh, should be fine. Oh wait, no, I can't put it- I don't have a bottle to put in it. Alright, where are you? Oh, there you are. Passing at 40 meters a second. Ah, don't cook me with your ion beams. <laughs> Alright, what? Oh man, we're gonna have so much clanging from that gravel that's floating around. Come back, get in your ship! What? What? It says oh, it's no, in three, three minutes. minutes. Sorry, it just disappeared for a second. Jeez, Thanks, you're Daniel. freaking me out. <laughs> uh, grids, small tubes, motors. Oh, silly cat person, so close. <laughs> Being here for the first bit of the action. Yeah, David, I agree. I expected to overcook that much worse. And we're out of iron. Okay. Alright, I got this gun on the roof up and running. Uh, aiming radius, 800 meters, target, I guess we just want it to target small ships? Yeah. Two minutes till first wave. Should it target missiles as well? Uh, no. No, because it's a big turret. I have no idea if decoys are going to work because a lot of these drones have fixed weapons, not turrets. Uh, there are, there is like at least one decoy attached to this base already. Yeah, I know. And I've got another gun up and running. I presume this thing's piped up. Alright, Kapak, you should probably get in your ship. Uh, there is a survival kit in here. Is it functional? It is now. Uh, I'm gonna grab this little fighter ship thing. Okay. Uh, where'd I park? There we are. At least I can use this for the first round. Okay. Yes, I blue printed my ship. Yes, yes, yes. Oh boy. Wave in four, three, two, one. Here we go. First wave. Uh, two drones coming in. Taking out drone 52GG1GT. That's my target. The 
think I might have already shut it down. Yep. That drone's down. Geo's down. Yep, I think so. Oh, Wave but... one complete. Base wasted a fair amount of ammo. Yeah, I think my thing is too because I'm not in it. That's all right. Still got more being, more magnesium being refined. Uh, turrets. Got Twenty three boxes of ammo left. Yeah, you're fine. Uh, I did see there's some kind of constructions on some of these nearby asteroids. Yes, there are. You can use them as decoys in a way, I guess. Uh, how much magnesium we got? 1267. That should go in the refinery. What have we got here? Okay, all the magnesium is refined. Uh, I'm making all the ammo we can make. Yeah, there's a little base up here that's got a decoy, a battery, a small container. Needs a bit of work, though. Yeah, I've sh I just shoved a few decoys around the place. Yeah, that doesn't have O2 yet. Uh, there's... Oh, yeah, this place needs repairs too. Yep. Uh, two minutes till the next wave. I don't think we're going to have time to do much repairs on them. We should yeah. probably just focus on our ships. Don't think um, I took any damage. I, I might saw keep a couple of planks. I'll keep using oh. this little fighter for the first few waves. Uh, I need a bunch of steel. spotlights on this thing oh the next wave's coming in are they scripted they're scripted spotlights or are they my headlights they're my headlights i'm a dope what am i thinking come on splitsy get your head in the game i think i patched up my armor back at the cockpit Yep, the fighter has a gun cam, which I will use. Wave in one minute. Nope, three seconds. Oh, what? Wave two okay. incoming. Guns are hot. some fire. Okay. Uh, that one's still got it. Yep, that worked. Okay, two waves down. Didn't expect to run into too much trouble just uh, yet. Military escort? Uh... I mean, we could try and pirate it, but I think it'll take too long. I think the next wave will hit before we get the chance to. Yeah, two minutes. Unless one of us went off to pirate it, but I, I don't think that's enough help. Uh, did I take any damage here? Doesn't look like it. They all seem okay still. Doing some armor repairs. Yeah, it is unfortunate we can't use the military escort to help us. We could go over there and pirate it because it's currently friendly to us and we could probably take control of it relatively quickly, but I think it'd take us probably about 10, 15 minutes to do so at a minimum. And several waves would come by in that time. So I think we're better just sticking around. Sticking it out to the end. Yep. 
Now it is a fight of attrition. Will Kapak and I run out of ammunition, or we will will we run out of ship first? Oh, that's a good point. I'm down to 22 boxes. I got plenty in the cargo hold though. Looking okay. Yeah, we just gotta hope we uh, can pick some of it up if some of our turrets get lost. Oh, well, oh, maybe we should be... Trying to loot it? Well, scouting these, this debris field. Ah, oh, there's some ammo. Yeah, actually, that is a good point. We should be trying to do that. I don't even know where the debris field is anymore. Uh, it's kind of planet wood from the, from the base. 48 seconds. Oh, couple of boxes of ammo. <laughs> Najuju just said, um, they're so used to me leaving cliffhangers that they expected me to say, to start an outro and say, will we survive? Find out next time. Ah, my thing that says when the next wave is coming is gone. 24 seconds. Is good bot being a bad bot? And not telling you things. Yeah. 17. 14. 12. Yep. Ten. Thanks, Mr. Java. Six. Four. Three. Two. One. Wave inbound. There are a few more this time. Oh, there are two. Uh, guns, you want to shoot? There we go. Oh, incoming missiles! Oh! Ah, uh, there's a large grid ship, come back! Where? No, that's you. What? Jeez. <laughs> You've got no friend or foe signal up. Whoops. Think they're all down? Yeah, I think so. Oh, I took a missile hit to the front. Dinged up my armor a bit. Need to help repairs? Nah, should be alright. Let's see if I can find any ammo in this debris. I think I found some uranium, but that's about it. Whose uranium? Your uranium. Ah. Uh, and some missile containers. And some platinum. None of which are particularly useful to us right now. Hmm. Could we get a missile turret up quickly on the base? Uh, maybe. Oh, maybe I should try and get it up on my ship. While you focus on taking on the next wave, which is coming in one minute. Yeah. Because then I can hold, we can hold that back till later. Alright, that looks like it's all I'm going to get. Guns Use. took a bit of damage. Alright, I'm going to fly back. You take care of this next wave. Alrighty. Yeah, they are, I picked up, I think, 28 missiles or rockets or something. Um, so then I can, I'll stick a turret on somewhere. Oh boy. I'll have it turned off until we get, until we start fighting against bigger ships. Get out of here, SPRT Mayday. Wave in 51 second. Yep. Wait, why is my chat saying that you shot me? I did. I said Urgh. sorry at the time. How rude. I act I already told you. I went, that back, there's a giant drone. It's a big red one. And I went, oh no, wait, it's you. Oh. 
Yeah, I shot you in that. Uh, what? 16 seconds. Gun's hot. Hey, I'm good to have on your team. But just don't paint your ship. Whoa, the same as the enemy. they spawned right on top of me. Oh, and jeez. I think we're good. What was that? Um, uh, drone hit my ship and the asteroid did, right next to me. It looks like he crashed into the asteroid. I got some ammo from it. All right, repair crew. Investigate. Uh, it's all looking good, but. Wait, have I... Oh, I took some engine damage. You did? Yeah. Wait, why is this thruster off? <laughs> why is my ship moving? Uh, have you lost a thruster in a direction? What the... You'd look... Uh, like why are a bunch no... of my thrusters off? Have you lost the piping to them? Not sure. Whoa! Whoa! Alright, I'll let you figure that out. Let's see if I can get some goodies from these drones. No. No. Oh. Uh, actually, no. I won't do that. I was going to turn off the trash cleanup, and then I realized that's probably a bad idea. We're going to accumulate a lot of rubbish. Uh, has something behind there been damaged? I don't know. It's weird which ones have decided to shut off. It's like there's something broken between this top turret and to the left here. There's something broken like, between this, this row and this This row. one over here is off, but it's attached to the hydrogen tank, so there's no reason why it shouldn't be working. Uh, they say they're toggled off. Have you toggled them off and grabbed grabbed them with your oh, turret? Oh, I might have. Yeah, I might have screwed up the groups. Yep, they are just toggled off. Yep, that'll do it. Hey, I sort of mentioned that I was shooting Capac. Forty I seconds. I'd it from what I said. All right, I'm not I turning the thrusters off, so I'm just going to remove that from the toolbar. I need all thrusters all the time. Uh, does the base have enough ammo? I don't know. Well, There's a wave in 12 seconds. Yep. Right. Gun's hot. We go. Oh, don't be in line of fire. Yeah. Okay, that was over quickly. Oh, that's cat back again. I think I missed that time. Cat back, you being red and them being red is really not helpful. Can you put a beacon on your ship or something? Uh, alright, I guess. Like, it is genuinely hard for me to tell. I know I'm blaming the person who got hit by the friendly fire, but it would help prevent me doing it again.
So is a beacon or an antenna cheaper? Beacon. Smaller too. Uh, actually I don't know if it's cheaper, but it is smaller. Oh no, where's my little ship? Where am I going to put this thing? Guess I can whack it on the uh -oh. back here. Oh dear. I Wait. can't spot. I think I lost the fighter. No! I don't know where I left it. Well, it's going after the ammo. I didn't realize it didn't uh, have an antenna one of your, on it. One of your turrets is on fire. Oh, okay. Let me come back and fix that then. Whoops. I lost the little fighter. No. There we go. I got a beacon on it. Computers and radio components. Yeah, agreed, Bernard. <laughs> Needs some sort of IFF style thing with this. Too easy for the mistakes I made to be made. Okay, Bernie turret is repaired, mostly. I think it must have gotten hit by some debris. Right, beacon's up. Excellent. Hopefully I won't shoot you again. Oh, there he is. Uh, dip, duck, dodge, dive, and dodge. the ammo off my cockpit. Whoops. Come on, debris trail. Have some ammo. There we go. More ammo. Oh dear, this doesn't look good. What doesn't look good? Have you taken some serious damage? No, just a lot of armor plates all bent up. Uh, there are infinite waves. This is going to go until we get destroyed. Uh, I'm going to set my turrets to target large grid because I'm not going to be organized enough to do so when I need to. I thought you said they were all small grids. As far as I've played it, they are, but apparently, according to chat, there are some large grid ones. Right. If we make it that far. Yeah, uh, I've left them on shooting large grids anyway. Ooh. I wonder if this wave is glitched because we've got a drone that's still alive. Uh, that's good. That means more time to prepare. Oh, two minutes. Ah, uh, come back. I need to take a very quick bio break. I'll be back in a moment. Oh no! I know! 
It's terrible timing, but I gotta go. No, don't leave me alone like this. So much damage. Oh, they're coming in again. Gun's hot. Did I make it back in time? Yep, I haven't shown up yet. Oh, yes. They're almost here. Oh. Oh. 55 seconds. Oh, so it's showing up again for you, is it? Yeah, it's intermittent. Bigger range. Thirty seconds. All right, now I'm going to be able to find this thing a lot more easily. Three hundred meters is not enough. Uh, yeah, I think there probably are a few little ion thrusters. Oh. Iron. Oh, yeah, there's iron up here. I might want to drill that. Space Pirate Spur. Jeez. You know what? I'm not taking the fight at this time. I'm going to go on foot or on jetpack and I'm going to try and loot as much as I can. target. Nope. Oh dear. Oh, that's... Um, what happened? Oh, things are getting real crooked. You need me to do some, help you with some repairs this time? Uh, possibly. Uh... Any chance you can get a bit closer to the base to make it easier for me to grab some stuff to fix that turret for you? Uh, yep. Uh, I'm just going to move my ship around and mine some of this iron that's here so that we've got enough resources for all the stuff we've got. There's magnesium in one of these asteroids here. Well, the, the thing on the base said it was a magnesium power generator. So presumably there's some magnesium around. I can't see it on my HUD. 
I only see iron and ice. Some little mining ship up there, I think. <laughs> oh. If I touch you, it's going to be most unpleasant. Oh, get out of here, Skeletor. Ah. <laughs> uh, you're very welcome, and thank you, Mr. Shaba. I think that'll do for the mining. Let's see what's in this asteroid. What is that ship that's in there? I'm betting it's a mining ship, but it might have something useful. Not really. No. Not too much useful on that. For what we need. Uh, is there magnesium over here? Nope. Uh, what about over here? Nickel? Full. More nickel. I think one of these clusters does have magnesium. Because I feel like this uh, scenario was made before stone could be refined. So it has all the basic stuff. That looks further away. Are there any other asteroids that I haven't checked? We've got iron, nickel, silicon, and ice. Grr. Dang it, I don't think we got anything else. Why can't I get these motors? I'm too full. Have you got scrap on you? Just ditch it. Uh, the stream from this end, as in for the space engineers bit at the start, we're going to keep going until we die. I don't know how long that's going to be. <laughs> it's already going better than I thought it would. Alright, guns are back. Uh, but I was expecting somewhere between four and five hours. And then we're going to head off to Twitch to do some more stuff. I'm not heading to Twitch. Well, Capac's already on Twitch. Twitch.tv forward slash Kapak Amaru. For those of you who didn't already know. Was that the response you were hoping for? Eh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> That's a point. There might be some ammo in that turret. Kapak. Uh, do you think. Wave coming in two minutes. I think one of these early waves, I should leave you behind to go grab some magnesium, then come back. Oh, well, that sounds terrible. So, should we deal with this wave and then I'll do that? Ooh, or is that a reason to try and repair that mining ship? Oh, no, I can't put that there. Weirdly, I think magnesium is going to be our problem. One minute. Oh, good day. Good bot's gone. Left me. I can't see it anymore. Uh, still says one minute. Thanks, Anubis. Yeah, I'm thinking it might be worth trying to repair that little ship now. Go off and mine with it, but leave this behind. So Kapak can stay. I'll have a look. Let's see what I need to do to repair it. 
Fifty seconds. Uh-huh. 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 Ah! What just happened? No! Part of my ship just floated away. <laughs> Did you break off part of your ship? No, um... Oh, one of them must have... Actually, I'm not sure what happened. I was adding blocks. I don't see how adding blocks could have made bits float away. How long till the next raid? Maybe 18, 18 seconds. seconds. Oh, seven <coughs> seconds. Uh, no, I won't be able to do that, Tyler. Sorry, man. That's not the format of what we're doing today. Oh, that is way too zoomed in. Oh! Oh, that was close. Point defense guns, why aren't you shooting the missiles? They seem unreliable at best. Oh gee, there are a whole lot more coming from the other direction. Oh! Oh! Those were close! Give me something good. Oh. That's All right, I'm going to go back and try and repair that mining ship. Oh, what the? Guns are a bit screwy. The what? What? Guns what? were a bit messed up. What's wrong with them? Why weren't they targeting the tar the, the uh, I, I think. I think they were alternating which ones were switched on and off. Oh. I think I fixed it. I hope you have. Which way was this ship? Hello, mining ship. Where are you? Are you here? You're here. Uh, every time I get out of the cockpit, the corridor to the cockpit is all crumpled up. <laughs> They're trying oh, man, to shoot me. Do I keep losing track of where this thing is. fine without those thruster components I'll manage. Won't manage without the gyroscope though. Come on, get fixed. Uh, no, I do not have a small cargo full of magnesium ore. I have already transferred it to the main ship to get processed because I remembered about that. Are we out of iron? What? Oh. Dang you, gravel! You nuisance material.
Oh. Uh, yeah, I could probably move the nickel from the assembler too to create more room. Uh, but I think this thing is ready for me to use. Oh, those batteries are totally dead. How very unhelpful. Uh, right. How's uh, best to do this? I think battery... Yeah, I think let's just get rid of these batteries and replace them. Too many. No, the batteries weren't just off, unfortunately. Thanks, Joel. <laughs> Two yeah. minutes. I'm a bit sad with the way that Seven Days to Die went as well. Maybe one day. But I'm glad you've enjoyed it all the way along. <laughs> Are you ready to handle this wave on your own? Uh, eh. I'm leaving the big ship, like my big ship, behind. Uh oh, I need oxygens. I'm just going to take this little mining ship out and grab as much magnesium with it as I can. Ooh, one minute. Okay. I'll see what I can do. Good luck. I'm going to go grab as much magnesium as I can. Uh, which way is magnesium? I need to put the thing back up. Magnesium ice, nickel magnesium is closer. Here we go. Oh, something else has been hit. Oh, my spotlight. 18 Ks to go. Bottles? I didn't ah, see any bottles. Did shot. Splitsy make bot? Big shot by what? There's a space pirate antenna out there. I think there's a disabled drone. I thought it was dead, not still armed. Ah. Oops. At least didn't lose the battery. Oops. <laughs> Good timing on suggesting I might need defenses, but not. <laughs> Oh dear. 25 seconds. Now I'm interested to find out whether the drones are going to spawn around us or if they spawn around that location. Thank you for the reminder about increasing the antenna range so I don't lose this thing. In fact, you could fill up an oxygen bottle and use that so you don't have to keep going back to refill as often. Well, you don't ignore me as usual. I'm a bit busy. Oh, are you fighting at the moment? Yes, you are. Look at those glitters in the distance. Blamo! Uh, I hope none of them follow me. That's a good point. Oh! Don't plink me! I suspect the way this uh, mission is scripted is that the 
uh, they're scripted on a particular coordinate as opposed to anything else. And then I have none after me. Uh, do I have an ore detector? Yes. I'm almost at the magnesium asteroid. Alright, I think the wave is dealt with. Good job. Hopefully I can get back before the next wave comes. So I really don't want to come back in the middle of the fight. Oh, I think I lost some armor blocks. raining so heavily outside right now. Your car's not going to get flooded in, is it, Kamak? Uh, it's, it's out the back. Okay. I mean, it might get flooded in back there, but if that <laughs> happens, we've got stuff. other problems. Yes, like trying to move our computers rapidly upstairs before the house floods. Yes. Whoa, what on earth was that? Arg! What? A drone just smashed into my ship. Oh no. Uh, doesn't seem to have done any damage though. That's unlikely. And lucky. Where is the magnesium? Oh, uh, two minutes. Yep. I've made it to the asteroid. No, that's not the answer. The answer is I'm coming back from the asteroid with a load of magnesium. Uh, that's not what ha what is happening. We're trying to find the magnesium on the asteroid. Oh, these damn ah. corner pieces keep getting obliterated. Hopefully I only have to do this once. Oh no, my oxygen tank's exposed. That gets hit, there'll be a big bada boom. Um, uh, no, but sure. You want to believe that? I mean, there should be. It's still like pressurized gas in a cylinder. Yeah. I know. Okay. I am loaded up. And I am sluggish. Uh, I think I've repaired most of my armor. Can't fix the spotlight, but... Wave in 38 seconds. Yep. I'm on my way back. I'll probably arrive after you've handled them. It's optimistic thinking. Oh no, I just I know how long it's going to take me to get back. My acceleration is slow. Alright, guns are hot. Maybe if I lurk in the shadow of this asteroid I can surprise them. <laughs> yes. Deceleration is also slow. That is a very valid point. I must not forget that. I'll probably Incoming have to start... enemy dyad. Ooh. Yeah, you're at wave. We're at wave ten. Uh, it seems to be the only spawn. Uh, I can break faster it's... than I can accelerate, which is good. I think it's dealt with. Cool, wave in two minutes. Good job. 
Uh, any ammo munitions? You have more thrusters on reverse and on the side and on the right. Left is two, down is two, up is two, and forward is two. Nope, I got nothing. Uh, I would accelerate faster if I turned my ship, but I'm likely to forget that fact <laughs> and mess up if I don't. So I'm just going to accelerate this way until I get to about 8Ks out, and then I'll slow down from there. Oh, one of my guns took some damage. Oh, that's not good. Did how's my ship looking? Is it? Uh, did it don't, take any damage? Don't see any fire. Okay. I am twelve and a half kilometers out. I don't think I'm going to make it there for the next wave, even. Or I'm going to make it there as the next wave arrives. Seems more likely. I'm going to stop accelerating. At 94 meters a second. No, not uh, Yeah, Joel, I could rotate myself and accelerate using that. But I was... Just being safe to prevent myself from thinking that I can accelerate that I can because uh, I can slow down faster than I can accelerate and I like that for safety I'm going to have to start slowing down soon uh, probably now uh, we're running low on some basic components yep I'll mine some more Ryan Guns back online with five seconds to go. Oh, one second. Oh dear. There's a tusk. Is that the only thing? A tusk, a blue drone, and one of those SGGTs or whatever they are. Okay. I can only see the tusk from here. I am slowing down very, very, very slowly. Oh, what is going on with my guns? Oh, that didn't sound good. Did you just hear a clunking? Oh, I've lost the turret. Oh, no. Is that the first turret we've lost, though? Yeah. That's not too bad, because we do have now a not particularly effective way, but still a way to get some magnesium back. Like, I'm bringing 40-ish thousand. Hopefully get us a few hundred cases of ammunition. I still got lots of ammo left. Good. Maybe I didn't need to go get the magnesium, but it was probably better to do it early than later. Yep, and they're all piped up because I can fill them up. I kind of thought this got harder faster than it has. Well, because that's we easy for you unprepared. to say. You're off gallivanting around the universe while I take all the fights. <laughs> well, I mean, you haven't been destroyed yet, so you're doing fine. I mean... I don't know, it depends on if you allow for percentages or not. Whoa, What are you whoa. shooting at? That's not me, that's you. I get it too. 
Maybe that drone had a little bit of thrust left. Well, the tusk is still around, but it's drifting away. Oh, I lost the gun and the conveyor. Alright, I have arrived. We don't have a connector, so I'm gonna have to manually transfer stuff. Two minutes. As I watch a piece of scrap bounce off the fighter. I thought you lost the fighter. No, I found it again. Right, let's get this magnesium refined. Oh, I lost the interior turret too. Tony, I couldn't really do anything like that uh, with a patrolling drone or even trying to build little sandbag-esque type things I think is just too time consuming for the amount of time it gives you to prep between stuff. Uh, if you had a larger team you could probably have some people focusing just on building stuff while the others try and provide forward defense and protection. But as it is with just the two of us, I don't think that's really feasible for us. Alright, let's just hide this inside the rock. Brand damage from most directions, in case we need this thing again. What? No, that's a missile launcher, not a Gatling turret. Uh, in drones, drones, drones! Yeah. No, I'm not ready. down another turret. I've only got the single one left. Oh, jeez. Okay, we've got to repair. I'll help you repair. After this round. That spurs right on the base. I think I just nailed it. And you did too. <laughs> there's there's a tusk just sitting there. Yeah. Is it dead or is it... I mean, it's not moving. Oh, it's moving a bit. I'll go get it. Why I'm hearing it, hearing the sounds of your thrusters. Quite weird. Right. The tusk has been poached. Alright, if you bring your bring your ship over and then we can do the repairs here. Two minutes. I'm 
maybe just carry enough ammo to have, say, five or ten crates in each thing. I just saw a hole in my ship. Yes, there it is. Quite the large dent. Oh, don't talk to me about large dents. Oh, I think I might have crashed into the rock a bit there. Whoops. Whoops, the daisies. All right, we need to get you a turrets, yes? Yep. All right, production. All right. Oi, quit it. Where'd you go? Oh yeah, you've taken quite a pounding. Yep. Having two ships for this has made a huge difference though. One Let's minute. There on here. What? What is? Oh. Go back. Have you got ammunition for all the turrets? I just finished off another one of them. Uh, there should be ammo in the cargo. Oh, they're here. Oh boy. Big thruster. Make sure you know. No. Makes your ship move in a really fascinating way. Whoa! Oh, that didn't sound good. I think you got hit by some debris. Yeah. All right. Can you free it, come back here, and I'll help you repair. ship went into that fight better than it came out of it. It came out of the previous one, I should say. Man, I wish I had a better welder for this. I make this so much faster. Give me that oxygen. Uh, any of my guns get damaged this time? No, but one of your conveyors did. Uh, do you want those hydrogen engines? What? You've got two hydrogen engines at the front that are damaged slash missing bits. Uh, at the front? Yeah. Uh, there's this one that's not on for whatever reason. 
Because it's on fire. No? Oh, the engines. Oh, no, I don't need those now. Forty-five seconds. Uh, did I actually get the? Oh, I did get the platinum here. I can make a better welder. Oh, jeez! Twenty seconds. You might want to get in the pilot seat. Okay, fine. I'm like a window washer as you drive away from this <laughs> traffic lights. Oof. Let's see if I can grab some ammo. That hurt. Ooh, those bullets have come close to my head. Very close to my head. Jeez! Oh, almost hit that guy. Oh, it's really hard to aim and not get hit at the same time. Oh, oh back, you well. just straight into that. It's all right. I'm still good. I think you lost a turret in the process. Uh, nope. Turrets. Uh, oh, jeez. Nope. The bottom turret's been ripped clean off. Yes. Because you smashed straight into a, a drone. No, but the bottom turret. I hit it with my nose. I don't know how I lost the bottom turret. I think you hit it with your nose and your bottom turret. <laughs> Alright, get back here. Let's repair you. Doing surprisingly well. Oh well, that bottom turret was extend ex extendable, <laughs> expendable anyway. <laughs> uh, no, these waves never slow down or stop. They continue going forever. Yeah, I guess if... Fuck, I really wish you'd park a little bit closer than that. Look, I park as close as I'm comfortable quickly arriving and leaving without crashing into things. Fair enough. Fair enough. Oh no! Uh... Well... Did not think that was going to be owned by someone else. What did you do? <laughs> Oops. Did you lose anything important? Uh... My dignity. <laughs> oops. Oops, oops, oops. <laughs> uh, Co oh Codon, I don't know how the drones smell. They don't have any noses. Uh. Oh no, is that... Is this not attached now? Uh, what, about, what did I break? I don't know if this armor block here is attached or not. 
think it is. Oh well, 10 seconds. It's time to fight anyway. If I can get in the that cockpit. That is the wrong type of turret. Oh, he's gone. Nope, wasn't attached. There it goes, off into space. <laughs> Man, last time I hired Spilitzi to do repairs on my ship. Yeah, I, I did bad. I did bad. <laughs> it's like you take your car to the mechanic and he just starts shooting it with a shotgun. Chat at a really bad moment then. Face planted and half killed myself. <laughs> Are you on your way back? Yeah. The walls are closing in on me. <laughs> what? Hello there. Oh. Would you like a banana? Yes. Uh, that's not good. Oh man, I could go for a banana right now. Steel plates. I need steel plates. And I need them within two minutes. Yep. I think we've got plenty of them though. Dang it, I need that angle. Uh, where's Cap at? Okay, I think, I think we can get you back up to mostly repaired now. We've got plenty of steel plate. Are you missing any turrets still? Uh, just the, the one underneath. around here too uh, I did I did make a blueprint of this before the fight I don't think we're at a point in this fight where we can build a projector and <laughs> repair no. these things properly I am just patching this up as good as I can as quick as I can yeah I think constant patchwork is the only way to go here We don't have a dedicated pit crew, unfortunately. Well, I'm a pit crew, I'm just not dedicated. Oh, um, incoming. Oh, 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 D. Yeah. Jeez. 
he shoots off like a rocket when he goes, Oh! Speaking of rockets! Oh! The point defense, it does nothing! Oh man! Yeah, you may be better off turning the point defense to just shoot at the drones at this point. Bye. No. Yeah, I might check out Capax turrets when he comes over for the next lot of repairs. Uh, ooh. Oh, I think turret 4 is not firing because it's been disconnected. How about you coming over here? What? You're miles away. You're almost 300 meters from the ship. Well... I'm closer, and then we can do more repairs. Uh, I think I'm mostly fine for repairs. Just got to figure out what's go going on with the piping. All right. I'll check out what your turrets might or might not be doing. Yeah, so turret four is the one that's not getting ammo, which is... Oh, not not that thing. I was going to check out your point defense. This one. Do you even have any point defense turrets left, or are they all destroyed? Uh, the ones on the back are just hanging on. They are set to target missiles. They're usually better set to smaller ranges. Well, I don't think I've seen them fire at all. Yeah. I've often found they're not particularly good at doing what they're supposed to do. Um, yeah, no, oh well, whatever. So this cargo container's not attached to this, but this conveyor's fine. What way oh. are we up to now? Yep, this cargo container's exploded. Um, are you planning on some kind of elaborate suicide pact? What do you mean? Is that why you built a missile launcher that could only fire at the asteroid it's directly facing? Uh, it's switched off and it's been off since I built it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, running out of time! They're here! No! I can't fix the cargo in time. We got him. Yes. I think we have. Uh, magnesium. Next wave in two minutes. One hundred and twenty, two hundred and forty. All Now I'm getting littered by debris. Oh. Cool. 
some bits bigger than others. Hmm. What the? That was wave 17. Kapak has the best welder. He picked it up before. He's got the best welder and grinder. Don't you? Yeah. 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 Thought so. Now we got three reactor components, 12 thruster components. Uh, what can I do that's useful here? I think I might try and build some of those sandbags. Production. Let's get... Battery and turret. Ah, <laughs> uh, the fight is still intact. Or it was last I checked. Where is it? Fighter. Yeah. Still shiny and new. Why are you trying to make a large cargo container? I need a small one. That should okay. be working now. Battery, and then turret. Oh, that's right. Turrets need to be not in voxel. Oh, dang it. Has to stick out a fair bit. One minute. Yep. I'm going to place down some uh, forward gun positions around this asteroid. Yeah, the debris from the ships is what's doing oh, the most they come. damage, I think. Oh! Because they charge in fast. Oh! Something shot one of my pirates I put down. Oh, there is a lot more fire going out this time. Oh, the turret on the base is damaged. Ow! Did not see that until too late. That hurt. Where's my body? Where's my body? Where's my body? Where's my body? Oh, I need to take out that spur. It's doing a lot of damage. didn't notice come back I died during that it, what yep a face planted into a drone that I didn't see well wait it, what you were in the fighter nope oh you just well <laughs> hmm <laughs> I was trying to get go over to the base to repair the turret on it which was damaged I think you might have already repaired Did you repair the turret on the base? No. Oh, I no, just got back. That one. 
Right now I'm dressed in blue as well. What would happen? I want to be dressed in blue. Yeah, the the drone, <laughs> the drone did look like it didn't. It was pretty dark against a pretty dark background. It snuck up on me proper. <laughs> Oh, Capac, uh, that brings me to just one death less than you. What? What? Wait, what was the other time I died? You died twice at the... in the beginning. So we're even then? No, I've died once. No, because you died in the beginning as well. No, 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 I'm not talking about those that time. Um... I'm trying to think of how you died, but you've definitely died twice. I can't remember. I got shot by the... Well, I got shot by my current ship. <laughs> yep. And you died from something else as well. Oh, right. I crashed into the asteroid. Oh, we're out of iron again. Okay. Ah. Uh. There are too many blocks that need repairing. Uh, drones! Oh dear. I think we might be hitting that point where we start not being able to recover between each round. <laughs> I've been at that point this whole time! Oh no, I lost my gyro! I lost my gyro in the fighter! Oh, sorry fighter. You're gone. Bye. And we'll take all your goodies. Not the most effective of things, but you did serve us well for a couple of rounds. Hey, that's not a nice thing to say about me. Why do you assume I'm talking to you when I say something that you're not very effective? Do you know you're not very effective? Uh, I'm pretty sure I've got more kills so far than you do. I'm pretty sure you do. Oof. Oh, I something's on fire. You ineffective. You were assuming I was. For some reason. Uh, you were projecting. I think that's what you were doing. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. Fix everything. Fix everything. I've only got two minutes! Not even an elite welder could weld fast enough. Oh no, my turrets take a damage. Needs construction components. Ah, whatever. Let's just do it this way. Mining with that ship is not a quick way of getting the iron I need. No, not being able to see this is not ideal. Inventory full. I did get rid of that light earlier, didn't I? That was dumb. How's um 
How's your ship holding up? Do you need me to help you rebuild any turrets, or have you got them all built back? No, yeah. I think I'm good. I might need some more ammo soon, though. Let me see what my situation is. I did make a bunch more. Got but I realised how well we'd be prepared for this, these battles. I would have said we only had two and a half hours. I wasn't expecting us to last this long. Oh no, what's happened now? Great, now I can't access the first turret. No? Uh, no. Something over here is damaged, I think. Oh, 24 seconds! Small cargo! My internal pipeworks keep getting damaged. Yeah, that's one of the biggest things I think that slows us down in terms of getting the repairs is that that stuff's always going to happen. No. Oh. Displays compute. What? Hmm. Oh, they're here. Uh, yep, they sure are. Oh, that's a large grid that is drifting towards my ship! Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that's the problem with being stationary. Yes. Thank you, Camac. Wreckage for goodies. There's not a lot left. <laughs> Surgical kamikaze on the rocket turret. Yes. I did do that. Oh, ammo box. I'll take that. Oh, the uh, one of the asteroid guns has taken some damage over there. Yeah, I'm just repairing this first. Uh, that's all my guns back up and running. Which asteroid gun has taken damage? Uh, the red one. Have you one. already got it? No, right. I haven't. Oh, right, I see, yeah. I haven't actually gotten that one operational yet. Despite several attempts. I think the next time I build one, I'll build a bunch, a row of armor blocks so the battery won't get destroyed between rounds. Or shouldn't. And it might soon be time to activate the cell turret, might not. Wait, is that? No, it's still working. One minute. Oy, 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 oy. Oh, these bullets are smushing my armor panels like they're made out of plasticine. Oh, a few stray bullets got awfully close to the hydrogen tank. Yeah, you'll be in trouble if you lose that, won't you? You will be dead in the water, won't you? Yep. It's pretty well protected, but... If it goes, goes, everything goes. Yep. <laughs> it's it's odd fighting a battle. Wave 21 incoming. Um, it's odd fighting a battle that you know you're going to lose, but you're trying to see how far you can get. Oh. 
good in here that I can get before it disappears. Good job, Capac. That went all right. Yeah, the large grid debris was fortunately not traveling very fast, so it only damaged the turrets rather than completely destroying them. More repairs, more repairs. Okay, Thank you for the away. prime sub, Z88. What the? Yeah. Is that you? Yeah, that was debris hitting my ship. It sounded very loud. <laughs> yes, it did. <laughs> it did sound very loud. Yeah, that's true, Boris. It is kind of 80s style gaming. Uh, will Kapak upload his perspective to YouTube? Probably, but will he do so in a timely fashion? Probably not. I'll try. <laughs> Things are very busy at the moment. But I've been trying to get the space ones out relatively quickly. I think people are still waiting on your last one from Perton. Yeah. This is true. <laughs> oh man. This thing is starting to look nothing like what it did when I started. That's kind of cool though, isn't it? In its own way. You know, I'm gonna make another blueprint. Uh, what should I do here? Do I want to put the turret on the same angle? The hot dog extra armor edition. Alright, we're going to have incoming soon. 30 seconds. Okay. Thanks, Roden. Oh, jeez. Uh... How about Rodent apparently got fired from the calendar store for taking a day off? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I thought you might like that one. How about we could start trying to get ion thrusters onto yours, but I don't know that we'll ever get the parts. Yeah, I, I wouldn't worry about Oh. Okay, we might have a problem. What's that? Down to 28% fuel. Oh. Oh dear. Yeah, that, that could be a big problem. There is ice here. This could be a good way of getting a bunch of extra parts of out. Uh, Relatively cheaply. I don't have a generator on board. Well, that's something you need to add then, isn't it? Uh... That's not going to be easy. Uh, you can probably put one in where that engine was at the front. Uh, Alright, i gotta got a spot for it. Why do I have my lights off? Oh, because I died. That's right. That is not the turret I was looking for. Steel plates, 
steel plates. Oh yeah, your your ship does have a connector. Fav's right. Um, I could use the mining ship and grab some ice with that if you can get the. Uh, it's alright. I got it. I got the generator on. Um, I could probably just oh, hand so mine. Well, no, there's this, this little ship that can do it for you. How much space do I have? Not much right now. I need to empty this. Twenty-four seconds. No. Back to the bridge. They're here. It's a fairly sizable wave. There are a couple of molars out there. That means missiles. Oh, I see him. Oh, I took a missile. Jeez, the way you're flipping about out there. Oh, I think you just got hit again. Or did you pop that one? Maybe you popped that one. Not sure. Yeah. I didn't see where it came from or what happened to it. I think one exploded just short of you. I think you got it. All right, if you come back, I'll quickly grab some ice. this thing. I think it is going to be the point that a failure for your ship though. You're going to run out of fuel. Uh, I don't I, think we'll be able to. I don't have a connector on this anymore. I took it off. Can you add one? Uh, I guess so. You focus on that. I'll focus on getting you some ice. Where's the connector? Here we go. Alt middle mouse drops off stuff like I'm doing. Uh, you search my channel for build planner tutorial that goes through all the stuff on that, as mentioned earlier in the stream. Weirdly. Okay, now it's empty. Let's grab some ice quickly. Where was the ice? Ice is over here. Computrons. Oh, there isn't much ice here, Capac. Uh, I think we are going to run out of fuel. One minute. Uh, do you want me to just come over there with what I got? Uh, connector's up. Okay, where's the connector? It's on the side. Yep. I have rotated it towards you. Thank you. That does help. One minute. One of the turrets is not working. They look alright. Why do I get the feeling Capac's going to fight with me attached? Barnacle. Oh, I think one of the guns is disconnected again. Oh no. Okay, you good? You've got ice in all your generators. Alrighty, 17 seconds. Mining ship is getting out of here.
The hip? Yep. Wave 24. I think, Capac, if we reach wave 100, we're going to classify this as a win. 100? Yeah. I think we'll be lucky to hit wave 30. That's no, true, you might run out of fuel before then. If you run out of fuel, then we're sitting, kind of sitting ducks. Shoot the guy that's right in front of me that is shooting us. You trying to fuel conserve now? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> but I try to. Looked like you were flying a bit more conservatively than you had. Keep them right in my sights. Oh. Man, I love these mods that add traces to every single shot. Makes this so much more dramatic. Yeah. I think both my front turrets have been taken out. Alright, I'll help you repair. Yeah, get a bit closer if you can. Need some oxygen too. Closer than I anticipated. Right, where are your turrets? Fixed. Oh, my poor ship. Where else did you have turrets on this thing? I feel like you've covered up some of the turret. Oh, uh, there was one underneath. Uh, yeah, this thing isn't connected. It's probably damaged in here again. Yep, this conveyor's damaged. Ah. Yeah, the the traces add heaps. I'm so glad I got recommended that mod ages ago. And ow! You alive now? Yes. Getting the ammo. Are you getting the ammo? You're getting the ammo. You got interior Posted plates? Myself. You've got interior plates. Oh yeah, I should have gotten Kavak more ice. I don't think I've got time now though. War of Attrition. Capac ship is taking a heavy toll. Paying a heavy toll, I should say. Both, really. Uh, there sort of would be a way to add it, make a welding wall, but Capac ship is so irregularly shaped. I don't think it'd do as much as we'd like it to. For him to just be able to fly up and get repaired and then go off again. Unfortunately. So I think welding by hand is kind of the best we can do. Uh, the tracer mod that I'm using today is oh, U... 10 seconds. If you search on Steam for Ufold... It's one of Ufol's tracer mods. He's got a whole bunch of different ones that do different colors. Jeez, it moves quickly. <laughs> oh, missiles. I think wave 40 is the next one we'll get a heavy, like a big ship. Because we got one on wave 20. Unless it's wave 30.
fill the miner with ice. Okay. We'll try. Which direction is the ice in? Which way do I go to the ice? I've lost myself. What? The so ice is over here. Ah. I'm gonna try and collect a load for you in this next gap. I think capac has got more than one O2 gen. I think he actually had several on board that he just didn't realize. What? There's a bunch of O2 gens, but not a, not a hydrogen. You realize that ship's old enough that it would be called an oxygen generator instead of an O2H2 gen, right? What? An, o an oxygen generator is the thing that generates ice. Uh, generates hydrogen. What? Nobody told me they changed the names of things. They No, they changed it to make it make more sense. It's just in the old days it used to just be called an oxygen generator. But you've actually got several. I think you've got three or four. This is a regular game mode. This is the Never Surrender scenario, which is vanilla. I'm pretty sure, though I'm not 100% sure, that it is on Xbox as well. Not just PC. I thought all the scenarios were on Xbox now. Yeah, oxygen generator one, two, three, four, five. No, I might have to rebuild one of those hydrogen engines. Is your power running low now? Yeah. How low? Uh, two hours. Oh, that's enough. Well, that's without doing anything. Yeah, but you don't use much power when you're moving around. Hydrogen. Whoa! Did you just hit me? Oh, no. Saw sparks. Three seconds. Oh, they're here. They are here. Hide, 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 little ship, hide. Oh, missiles. Oh, boy. Did you get hit by any? Don't think so. Place where I want to be, not a place I want to be, not a place I want to be. Oh, ow! That was two hits. Didn't see those until it was too late. Oh man. Uh oh. I'm gonna guess the miner is a build from Aragath, one of the keen. One of the guys that likes a keen. Because uh, a lot of... He's responsible for a lot of the builds in the keen scenarios. At least the ones that were made before... The... Um, the valley one. Uh, Lost Colony. Don't know how much he did for Lost Colony or the other one, though. No, no, you can play these on PC definitely, but you might also be able to play them on Xbox. Pretty sure you can. But not confident enough to guarantee it. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, UFOL's bullet trails. That's it, Sean Nemo. Yeah. Oh boy. That's a big old hole. 
Oh yeah. That's some internals exposed. I'm so worried at some point the storm's going to cause us to lose power. Yep, that sounds about right. Repair that while I can see it. Let me fix. Uh, you can definitely play it on the Xbox version. Thanks, Mako. Because I thought Frost, the Frostbite scenario was the one that didn't initially go to Xbox, but then they added it later. Because people really wanted it, because... Honestly, Keen have done a pretty dang good job on these scenarios to make them fun. Pretty sure Capax enjoyed most of his time playing them. Most. Yeah, you didn't really enjoy the dying repeatedly on Lost Colony. Up over here. Uh, patch up over here. Oh, <laughs> yep. I can understand why you wouldn't have necessarily known what a, how to spell UFOL from me just saying it. U F O L. It's a perfectly cromulent word. Yes, Mr. Beer Seeker has produced quite a few useful mods. Yep, he's a cool dude with an admirable goal. Oh, wave incoming! Yep, it's here. I still get scared every time he flies off and I'm just on the hull repairing stuff. Oh! You took a missile? Yep. Uh, Kapak hasn't accidentally killed me yet, but I have accidentally shot him a few times. Well, shot his ship. That's why he's got a beacon. Goes the drone. <laughs> okay, cat back. Um, at what point do you think I should step up the challenge so that we can end this with a bang rather than a whimper? Uh, that's that's gonna happen regardless. Why? You're still intact. Uh, this thing isn't fueling as fast as it's using fuel. I'm down to what I was 15. thinking of doing was something like a quick reload and adding the modular encounter spawner and typing slash mes dot come at me bro. Sure. Uh, which basically causes it to spawn everything that it can in waves until you die. Yep. Do it. You want to do it? Yep. Really? Yep. Okay. Let's do this. All right. I am going to save the game. Save o game o. Save. There we go. We got the thirty. We got the achievement for thirty. We did. Yeah, I got the achievement for. Getting through 30 waves. I didn't see a thing. Did it pop up a thing? Yeah, it did on mine. It might not on yours because I'm host. Oh, there we go. You got it? I just got joint operation, bring it on, and I see dead drones. <laughs>
All right, so we made it to round 30. So these are the mods that I've currently got active. This is the mod that's giving the HUD. This is the mod that's giving the traces. Um, yeah. Survive Modular, 10 waves, survive corner. 30 waves, survive 10 waves with at least one other player. Yeah. And... Alright, hello. Actually, let's make this funny. <laughs> uh, yeah, we are in a bad storm at the moment. Uh, ow. Like, uh, I think we've had something like 250 millimeters of rain in the last two or three days. Or more than that. Yeah, it's been pretty crazy. Yeah. Uh, Alright, Capac, as soon as you load in, I'm going to activate the mod. Uh... And we are going to get overwhelmed so quickly. I uh, don't see... The game should be oh, short. There it is. Jeez. Took it, sweet time. <coughs> okay, as soon as you're in, I'm activating it. I'm getting it getting in the cockpit. There's no gonna be no time for repairs here. This is going to be pure and utter mayhem. <laughs> All right, once we die, I will spawn in the cockroach minus a shield, and then we can see, and that'll be the end. But we're going to die in these first. I want to see how long we last. Are you in? Nope. Loading. Okay. All right, I'm in. I'm getting in my ship. All aboard. What? Zero bro's coming at you. What? Next wave in four minutes. That should have worked. Uh, I discovered Assert Incorporated. There we go. Incoming. Hmm? I don't see anything. Uh, Kabak, there's a transport square, a wasp, and a Reaver Slayer incoming. Oh dear. Alright, well, transport square sounds... Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> sounds like my cup of tea. me to be eaten by the reavers yep 100 <laughs> percent. no no i accelerate so slowly the reavers coming after me first uh oh it's a lot of bullets oh reaver no stay away serpentine serpentine how you holding up there kabak yeah, doing okay against the hail of fire from this transport square. Oh, I saw some detonations. Yeah, that was me firing rockets at it. Back up, back. I think that's all my rockets gone. Alright, Reva, you're coming with me. <laughs> Jeez, that thing's fast. <laughs> oh, 
That's yeah, an I'm explosion. I don't know if I want to be, but I'm gonna be. Apparently, I still have rockets left. Where are you? I lost Ooh. track of your signal. Yeah, I smashed the reaver. I think I properly smashed the reaver. Oh dear, I'm down to nine fuel. Well, looks like Capac's gonna be joining me shortly. Alright, time to go out in a blaze of glory. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh no, why lag, why? <laughs> what happened? Take this, wasp! Oh, there he goes, Capac. Can't see him, though. Oh, I've lost all power. Swing around, bring the gun to bear. There's a whole lot of ships coming my way. Alright, abandoned ship. Oh, is that a splitsy? Uh, I don't have a beacon. Yep, that's a splitsy. Permission to come aboard. Granted. Whoa! Oh, Ow! Ow, that hurt! Oh, he left my seat very exposed. <laughs> oh man, they're all fighting each other. Oh, this is epic. Look at this scum fight. <laughs> oh, the... Transport squares back in. Taking fire from Ah, there. rotate, rotate. I don't have a view. <laughs> Go third person. No, I'm in one of the turrets. Oh. Alright, I'm heading back to fight the drones. Oh, Got there's drones drone too. Thanks, Ian. Oh, it is amazing being in the middle of this! Die, Tusk! Enemy guppy sighted! Where's the guppy? Oh, there. Let's go take out the guppy. I think we have a chance against it. Oh no, we're taking fire from the spur. Yep, I see him. Uh, I don't know why the waves aren't working with the come at me bro command. Oh, this is chill all of a sudden. Yes, I have very minimal acceleration cap. Oh. I can't really close in on things very quickly. The Guppy's <laughs> calling in reinforcements. We got a Reaver coming in. Yep. Off the starboard bow. I'm trying to chase that Guppy. Hunt him down like the Guppy he is. I think it's going away from me faster than I can catch it. Well, the Reaver's coming real close, so... Oh, well, yeah, it, it is. It might be going for the guppy. I think it might be. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, yeah, it is. No, Poor little fishy. The Reaver's beating us to the guppy. That's a lot of rockets. Well. Why aren't our guns shooting? Are we out of ammo? Think we 
Might have just drawn the attention of the Reaver. That's a lot of rockets coming at me. Or at the Guppy, I'm not sure still. Oh, hey Guppy. <laughs> yeah, I can feel the guppies. Uh, <laughs> good luck with the run tomorrow. Um, thanks, Andrew. Oh, Cyclops coming in. Ten o'clock. Hi. Rust Freighter coming in. We're still locked onto the Guppy as a target. Passing the freighter. Attempting to get back to the base. Taking fire. Taking fire from above. Oh! Cyclops! My gun went down. Oh, Taking half the turrets are down. I don't know how I haven't lost it yet. That didn't sound good. <laughs> Thanks, Mako. Oh! What is going on there? I don't know, we just flew through a space battle. Yeah, we did. Oh, lost another turret. I think we're down to just two turrets. Oh, I think I got hit with a bullet. Firefly. Alright, I think this is all we could do. It's time to FTL jump out of here. We can't. What do you mean we can't? Press the button. We don't we don't have a jump drive. Oh no. Oh, that didn't work. Alright, I have a plan for I have a plan. It's not a good one, but it's a plan. Here we go. Get that speed. It's definitely a bad plan. Huh? What are we doing? If they can't have it, if we can't have it, no one can. Have what? Ah! What just happened? Well, we crashed into the base. Oh yeah, I see a blinky light. Wait, Capac's not... Capac's still in his chair. Yep, I'm still in the chair and I'm still controlling the gun. <laughs> and I didn't die. <laughs> oh man. Alright, alright, we're going silly. Let's do one last silly thing before we call an end to this. Yep, that's fine. No, I'm not in creative mode. Ah, what an end. So, for those of you wondering, Capac and I are going to continue this stream over on Twitch. That's twitch.tv forward slash splitzy for my channel and twitch.tv forward slash Capac Amaru for his channel. And we are going to continue this fun in some, uh, oops, that's not how I get in, in some Space Engineers and some other games, basically until we're too tired to stop, to keep going, I mean. Oh. Right, let's go hunt something down to finish this off. Did, did you admin yourself and now the ship is invincible? Uh, the ship shouldn't be invincible, but I'm in a cockroach. Oh. Well, if you get a ship, I should get a ship. Yeah, you can. I've admined you. You can paste in a Fightertron or a whatever you want. Uh, get 
Get out of here, or video thing. But you won't have a shield. Um, That's fine. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I know what I need to do. We need to have one final battle. Roach versus Roach. What? Uh, can I spawn it? it look like I can. Oh, nuts. There we go. No fuel. Where are you? I'm on the cockroach. Yeah, where's that? I don't know. Do I have an antenna? Nope. Don't have anything. Uh-oh. I don't have no power. Here we go. This is going to be the end. I don't know I have any power. I don't know. Uh, Capac, there is a med bay on board this thing, though. No fuel. Uh, so Capac and I will be continuing streaming probably for another five or six hours. No fuel. Don't have any fuel, apparently. Come on. Now you're about to see why this ship had to go from survival unlikely. Look at that rain of fire. Your health Imagine is this with critical. a shield. Oh! <laughs> oh man. That's a way for the cockroach to go. Thanks, HD Hermits. Thanks, Kayash. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Show again. Uh... Well, I'm going to go grab a quick bite to eat, and Capac's going to do the same, and then we will continue this over on Twitch. Thanks for coming, everybody. I hope you had a good time. Uh, the links to our Twitch channels are in the video des in the description of the stream. I will be back with some more Survival Impossible, some more Escape from Purgatory very soon. There's all that and plenty more to come, and we'll see you then. Uh, yeah, see you uh, soon. After break. <laughs> don't yes, don't after go anywhere. Just a quick five minute break and we'll be back. <laughs>